Ladies and gentlemen, hello. How are you guys doing today, uh, my lovely little eggy weggy, yoki tokies, my little smeggy peggy? Ah, <laughs> uh, thanks, James. So that's very nice. You know what? That's a very sweet message. I'm gonna pin that. There you go, Zoe Noel. Remember to like and subscribe to help support this wonderful, that's a very cute message. How are you guys doing? Oh my God, my wife made the best dinner today. She made Cajun chicken pasta. Oh, so good. Oh my goodness, I'm so glad I married a woman who can cook. Oh, I am gonna, I'm gonna die happily at the age of 42. <laughs> I eat so well. Uh, that's amazing. Um, yeah, Cajun. If you have, if you haven't had chicken, Cajun chicken pasta, it's like um, creamy. It's like a creamy chicken with like it's very spicy, and the pasta is like cooked with the chicken. So she cooks the chicken breast and then she puts it on top of the pasta with like a bit of a creamy uh, substance, and it's just so good. She puts like spring onions on it. And it's delicious. It's so good. K Cajun? Cahoon? No, it's Cajun. Like, that's how she says it. Cajun. Sweetie. Cajun? Cajun. Cajun. Yeah, not Cahoon. Yeah, you hear that? Yeah, she corrected the chat right now. Um, my gay ass is here. Well, I'm glad your gay ass is here, too. That could be taken out of context. All right, so... Ladies and gentlemen, it's time to continue. Cajun, yes. Cajun, 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 Cajun. It's time to continue our lovely adventure. Last stream, chat kind of dared me into doing something, and I'm probably going to regret it. Chat dared me into training the worst unit in Radiant Dawn. Kisa. Kisa. This is the guy. We're, we're, we're training this guy. This piece of garbage right here. Um, don't love Darity. Yeah, a lot of people in chat dared me. So we're gonna try and train him today. I've never used him before. His growth rates, I mean, they're not terrible for a Lagoose, I guess. We have to keep in mind that Lagoose growth rates are generally pretty low in Radiant Dawn because they effectively get two stats every time they, they level up in a stat because of how transformation works. Um, yes, I'll bring him to the tower and everything. If I can keep him alive, that is. Oh, Anthony BM donated at a hundred bucks. Waza! Anthony BM, I appreciate your support. My future children thanks you. Um. <laughs> thank you. That, that made, that, thank you. I, I really don't know what to say. Thank you for being so generous. Um. Train him for five minutes until he goes on the death counter. I'm gonna try and do the unarmed training here. <laughs> Anthony he donates a hundred dollars if he uses to library. I, I I always like Anthony is like the weirdest donator I have because he just comes in, drops a hundred dollars, and he says wee -oo, wee -oo, wee -oo, and then he leaves. And I I'm just kind of dumbfounded, being like I, I don't know what to say, you know. Oh. Sophia's still a good unit. Member for 10 months. If you are taking the dare, stop whining about it and give him all the stat boosters and battle experience. So, um, I don't have any stat boosters to give him, and because he has Blossom, what I'm doing is I'm giving him bonus experience up to 99 before each map, and then I train and I let him level up, because with Blossom, he is much more likely... He is much more likely to get good stats, because Blossom allows you to roll twice for every stat. So he has an 85 times 2% chance of getting HP. A 40 times, like, it's not 80% with 40, it's um, it's 40 times 2, like 40-40. So I think it becomes like 65 or something. I, I'm not great on this, but something along those lines. What did I miss? Nothing? Nothing so far? You just tuned in? Um, what's so bad about Lyra and Kisa? Um, it's mostly the fact that, I mean, their stats are just not very good. And their level is pretty high, so they don't get that much. Like, Kisa's joined us at level 18. He doesn't have that many levels to grow. 
I mean, they both have slightly better growth rates than the other Lagoos. But they don't really make up for their terrible base. I mean, they're both supposed to be growth units. They join rather late. They have decent growth rates, but low bases. They're supposed to be growth units. But due to how little experience you get in Radiant Dawn and how and their kind of high base level, it's just very hard to train them. Yeah, why use Kisa? Because Downlot dared me to, and I've never used him before. And I, I kind of like the concept of taking someone incredibly trash and trying to make something off them. And he's a unit I've never used, so I think it's kind of funny, you know? This growth rates are... Yeah, his growth rates are not good. This is very true. Let me show you my team. So I have a very strong Ike. Uh, I'm using... He's actually supported with Kiso, so I guess I kind of have to use Ronolf. But he's, like, forced deployed in a bunch of chapters anyways. I think it, it actually works. Uh, I have a very strong Soren. He's an Arch Sage now. So he can actually heal, which is nice. I've got an incredibly busted Getri. Uh, really good wrist. He's got 18 speed. Uh, my Nephany is bonkers as well. My Braum is bonkers. 30 defense. Uh, I got a good Raisin, and we got Kisa. We got Mia, she's still alive. Mist is here. Oscar is here. Titania is also here. And I got Janoff and Oki, who are also here. But I don't know if I'm gonna use them. I, they're pretty good, but I... I mean... Their stats, they, you don't need to feel them right away. Yeah, it's a tough Neff. Train Brahms Sword Rank? Ah, I could do that. So, here we are in the Lava Chapter. It's actually not a bad chapter for training your units. Because the enemies mostly charge at you. You can just kind of hunker into a little ball. So we're going to do something called the uh, Lagoose Cruise. I just made that up right now. We're going to do the Lagoose Cruise strat. Which is, we're gonna create a choke point right here, deal with the Swordmasters are a little too dangerous. And then we're gonna place Ronolf and Kisa next to each other here, and they're gonna be fighting untransformed. And when Lagoose hit untransformed, they actually get decent experience. So, um, hi Donlot, everyone here. Hi everyone, Donlot here. Hi, hi Donlot, everyone here. Alright, so we're gonna, need, we're gonna do the Lagoose cruise right here. This is very similar to Awakening Slava map. Yeah, I think that's probably where it's inspired from. Engage mention, what? So, fun fact, I am actually working on two Engage videos. Can you guys guess what they are? It's something I've done similarly on the channel before. Can you guess it? Can you guess it? Okay, on the moment you say yes, guess it then. Oh, <laughs> dog shit was engaged, actually. Uh, yeah, okay, alright. Some some people have sort how to fix things. No, I don't like videos like that. I, I don't really do videos like that. Character spotlight did engage, fail. No, I kind of already did one of those. So, I'll, I'll give you a hint. I did a similar video for Tree Houses. Two similar videos for Tree Houses. Alright, so we are gonna put Kisa right here. And then we're gonna put Ronolf right here. And then we're gonna go and we are going to give him goodbye rhythm! Everything engaged did good and bad. Yes, right. You got it, Pospic. You got it. Yeah, so it's a video about everything that engaged did right, and then a, a video about everything engaged did wrong. And I kind of like that format because it allows me to really, like, it allows me to both shit and uh, shit and crap. Oh, no. It allows me to both shit and crap on a game. It allows me to both shit and praise. It allows me to. <laughs> It allows me to. <laughs> it allows me. To... It allows me to both piss and shit. <laughs> it allows me to both. It allows me to both praise and and crap on engage. That's what I meant to say. Not crap and shit on engage. That's not what I'm doing. Um. So. <laughs> We'll put Oscar right here, Mist here. Alright. 
I really don't get the hate for engage. Uh, well, hopefully in my video, the idea is that I'm, I'm going to highlight some of the things that engage did right. And uh, the idea, like, because I think there are things to pray, and I, I'd like to get a little more in-depth with my criticism, because I feel like a lot of the stuff that we often say about Engage is very samey, you know? So, I, f I feel like there's things to criticize that don't often get criticized. I mean, everyone can say Engage is cringe, right? But what does that mean? And everyone can say the world building is bad, but what exactly does that mean? So, I've had some help from some friends who wrote down a lot of bullet points for me. And, uh, particularly, I got some very good feedback from uh, Zelda Crafter. Uh, Zelda Crafter is um, one of the portrait makers from the Saga Row. He actually had a lot of good things to say. I get a lot of good criticism of Engage that I hadn't really considered before that I think is worth putting into a video. And I hope that the video is going to be a bit more nuanced than just saying cringe. Yes, oh, Zelda made like a huge Google Doc with, with, with feedback. It was actually... I didn't realize he was so good at critiquing games, actually. Um... So, I, I feel like there are things to say about Engage which has not been commonly said that much. And I'm looking forward to say those things. Who are you? You got Soren, okay. Could you give your opinion of the gameplay without DLC? So, I'm not really here to... I know that DLC makes the game easier, and I'm not here to pretend otherwise, okay? I'm not here to pretend otherwise. So, this, these halberdiers are what we want to level on, by the way. These halberdiers. Gameplay still sucks. Okay. The rigs. The rigs. Oh, the rings are trash. Okay. Well, that's your opinion. Um, I, I disagree a little bit. I think the rings... I think they dominate... I think... I would have appreciated it if Engage was like 30% less about the rings. 30 to 40% less ring? I think you would have been in a very good spot. And less of them, probably. Yeah, like, I think instead of having the rings join at set intervals, I think it would have been cool if you got to pick between a random set of them. L let's say, okay, how many rings are there? There's like 12, right? And then there's like um, a bunch of DLC rings. What if, instead, you end up with five rings at the end of the game? You get one in the early game, one, like, in the early to mid game, one in the mid game, one in the mid to late game, one in the late game. And every time, every time, you get to choose between, like, five. So you get, like, a selection of five rings, and you pick one. So every run is different, because you get different rings. Hmm? Would, that would kind of make it... That would kind of make it a bit more varied. And you would end up with five rings. Maybe less on harder difficulties. Because I just think you get too many rings. Like, when everyone gets their ring, which is just too broken, in my opinion. Anyway. The absolute cope from people that haven't even played the game. I mean, you don't know if someone has played the game or not. And to, to protect them, or to, uh, to defend them, you don't need to be a master chef to critique food, okay? Sure, someone who has just tried the game briefly may have less informed criticism. But I, I think saying that their criticism is not valid just because they haven't played the game enough, I mean, I disagree with that. What YouTuber? No, he's Zelda Crafter is not a YouTuber. Uh, Zelda Crafter is the uh, portrait maker for Andron and Rebellion Saga. He's known for making eight foot tall muscle mummies. That's kind of like his thing. It was a joke that, you know. Every unit becomes the ring. Ah, I disagree. I mean, the rings enhance the units for sure. I wouldn't say they become the ring, but, you know. Right, I'm gonna kill this armor knight because my Lagoose can't really hurt him. He crafts mommies. Yeah, exactly. Engage is the only Switch game that's Iron Man friendly. I'd say Engage is probably more Iron Man friendly than Three Houses, yeah? But that's not really saying much. Because Three Houses is a very unfriendly game. It's the unit that enhances the rings. Okay. Ah, I kind of disagree, but you know, that's, that's fine. Alright, so, uh, this is... So I put Daunt on Kisa. 
So he should not. There you go. Perfect. Okay. So here we go. So he's untransformed. I think he might. Yeah, he might need some strength to do damage to this guy. Let's see what he levels up now. He will get doubled, but he, he will train strength, strike rank, funnily enough. Let's see what he gets. Strength, let's go. Oh, he did. What? What? That's a Blossom level up! That's a Blossom level up, and he got magic? What? This is not happening. Did I really... Oh my god. Are you serious? Alright, if I can get the guy with 20 defense, I think Kisa will deal one damage to him. Oh my god, that's so shit. That is so trash. Oh my goodness. Nine. Okay, he won't he won't get one experience from punching. He'll get like five, so. If he deals actual damage, that is. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I need to get this guy with um I need to get this guy with 20 defense. Oh my god. Are you serious right now? I mean he gets one experience from punching, I guess. No no no, no don't attack him. Okay, what about this guy? All aboard the Tame Train. We got a cross. Yeah, that crossbow guy needs to die. Um. Oh my goodness. Crossbow guy needs to die, but the fighter guy might be okay, maybe? Okay, we'll, ne we'll need to. Okay, we need to be very careful here, so. Uh, Ike needs to go down with the Wind Edge, and he needs to kill the Crossbow guy, and the other guys might be okay, we'll see. He did- he did miss, yes, but he also didn't deal damage, which is a problem. Okay, I can do this, okay? I'll just need Nephany down here. Hit points, magic- Oh, let's go! Yeah, this guy needs to die. And then Oscar finishes him off, and then I believe the the halberdier. I do need to be careful though, because how much speed do they have? 21 speed. So that he'll get doubled. And how much damage do they do? Let's see, 39. Uh that's 39. That's 29. He should be fine. He should be fine, right? He should be okay. Yeah, I believe he should be fine. Is Ronolf dying in a game over condition? Let's find out. It is. So I need to make sure Ronald doesn't die, but he shouldn't die. Because he's got 30, he's got more defense than Kisa. Okay. He lives with 1 HP? <laughs> okay. So he needs to be fully healed. Got it. Okay. Okay, this is what I was waiting for. Okay, so let's see. Beautiful! He does one damage. Yes! Yes! That's right! Five, <laughs> five experience! Let's go. And then this guy will go for Ronald. And he, his hit rate is actually a lot worse. And Ronald actually deals six damage to this guy. Ooh. I gotta be very careful now, this can easily end my run. Yeah, this can easily end my run, I gotta be very careful here. 
Okay. We are doing it now. So what's what's very important right now is that I keep healing. Actually put Ike here so we can... Um, oh, I should have probably put him here. Oh well, it's fine. I can use um, I can use wrists. I can use mists. Yeah, so uh, they need to be on full health. Oh boy. If you lose due to Kisamaxing, I will I will laugh. We have to Kisamax, guys. It's important. We have we have to Kisamax. Lose the run. Kiss has potential, but another thing is that he fills it. Um I kinda need to heal Ronald. I think what I will do is I will rescue Riss, and I will bring Mist over here, and I'll heal. This is good experience for my healers. Drink a Vulnerary, and I'll just heal like this, and then I'll drop Riss off. Oh shit, I cannot drop Riss off. Well, yes, I can. Alright, I think we got things settled now. Yeah, there we go. Oh, we gotta be careful with Grayson. So this has two benefits. It trains Ronolf and Kisa. And it also levels up strike rank. Are we doing tower with only crap units? I haven't quite decided what we'll do for the tower yet. I know people want me to do a non-royal royal run. I think maybe that'll that is a bit too insane. We'll see. Alright, I think we will actually put. Oscar here, and Brom here, so that way we have two units that can heal this turn, which is important to do, you know? Yeah, so now these two will attack here, and I can use Raisin to keep their biorhythm good. He says non -bind. So, it's... I don't think so. I'm gonna be honest, I think the community is reaching with this one. They, they just kind of decided he was. I really don't think so. I'm sorry. I don't. I don't. I see no evidence of this. He has like two lines in the game. But they just they just kind of decided that this is what he is now. So, um... But, let's see if we can train him. I mean, I've never used him. This is how we're gonna do it, guys. I don't know what these two are doing. I really don't. Yo, Mangs. Yo, Vest Vestigia. I am trying trying to train a bad unit, and it's uh, <laughs> it's kind of difficult. Ah, oh, the wiki says so. Well, yeah, the wiki is the final authority, guys. Don't you know? <laughs> Twitter has decided. Yes. Like five lines of yeah. I mean, what I got gathered about Kisa and Liar is that they kind of do that. We want the commander's attention archetype, which is a pretty big, like, trope in anime. It's like, oh, the commander must notice me! No, the commander must notice me! I love it when I have to consult wikis on how to have fun, yeah. If you don't... Look. Okay, Ro Ronald will actually just kill that guy. But we have another guy. He has a crossbow, though. That's a problem. You okay, sweetie? My wife is yelling something from Are you okay, sweetie? Nah, she's probably fine. Um, <laughs> I could hear her voice. She was saying something. What? Oh, is that what you said? Okay. Mengs took his pills today? Joke's on you, I never take my pills. Let's see. Guys, pretending to have a wife again. Please don't tell anyone. Please don't tell anyone. Alright, so... I, th I think this is how we do it, if we want... Oof. So he gets... Yeah, he gets... F what? What? Why would you do this? 
Why would you do this? Okay, so here's the guy with a... Yeah, the mages, the helper deers might. Let's see, if they have 20 defense, I can... No, they got 21. Fuck. Getris. Oh, it's because he has provoke. Yeah, that's why. Yeah, that's why. That's what's happening here. Well, actually... No, the crossbow will not be good for this. Yeah, it's because of provoke. That is why, so we need to put him away. Gotta make sh absolute sure that not more than one person. Mine, stop talking to your imaginary friends. Well, who else am I supposed to talk to, guys? Kisa's growths are actually not that bad. We can keep them on screen if you want. I mean, they're... Um... They're pretty bad. I mean, they're good for Lagoose, I guess, because considering they get effectively double. <laughs> Sorry about that. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> oh my god. I just lost. <laughs> I just lost Mist! Oh, this is going badly. I don't think I can do this, guys. Well, that's, um, certainly not great. What? What happened? Huh? Why did, why did my, why did it reset? Why did it reset? What? What? Huh? What happened? Why did it reset? Oh. <laughs> okay, I'll kill Mist. I will kill Mist. What? I have no idea what happened there. That was really weird. Like, it lagged and then it reset. Oh, I think I know what happened. Yeah, okay. So I had a... Oh, like, my computer lagged. And I think that accidentally loaded a safe state. I am sorry, but I will kill her. I will kill her. No tainting here. I will kill her. I will kill her. She will not survive this. Mm. Now, this means... This does mean... I I'm sorry, guys. There's nothing I can do. This was just a technical difficulty, okay? I will kill her. I will kill Mist. I will kill Mist. Okay? I will kill her. I will kill her. The game reset. Yeah. I'm sorry, guys. I'm really sorry. I, I don't know. Like, that, that was just a technicality. But we will speed shit up. <laughs> we will we will we will speed shit up guys. It's gonna be okay. Yeah, so I'm gonna I'm gonna send Mist off to die because um, we are absolutely we are absolutely not we're not tainting here in this house. I mean we are tainting. But not in that way, you know? We are we are we are we are tainting, but not in that way. Taintiest of taints. <laughs> okay, guys. I'm sorry, okay? I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. Okay, no more tainting now. I promise. So I'm gonna kill my healer in turn one. Extra taint. <laughs> no, 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 no. Oh, I need to restart the whole game? Yeah, okay. Makes sense. Yeah, sure. I'm thinking maybe Kisa and Oscar should should support up instead of Ronolf. I'm not sure actually. All right. So what music should we listen to while we train Kisa? I don't usually take suggestions, but uh, we can. Uh, what, what should we listen to, guys? Crash patch? Yeah, absolutely. Okay, I hope I get a bad level up on Kisa again. Otherwise, people will accuse me of painting, and that's not gonna be good. 
All right, mists go die. Yeah, I'm gonna kill off Mist. Don't worry, I'm gonna kill her off. Don't worry. No, I'm not gonna let her live. She died. She deserves to die, so. That is not going to change. <laughs> no, no, I'm not gonna let Mist live. Mist is gonna die. Mist is going to die. Mist is going to die. No matter what, Mist is going to die. Not giving Chad a heart attack challenge? Impossible. You pr I think I may have accidentally soft reset my emulator or, or by accident. Yeah, it's kind of weird, but... Stop using dolphin emulator, just jailbreak your Wii. I wish I had one. Oh, I shouldn't have killed that guy. That was dumb. No mists! Die, there you go. I love how it reset when she died, so you have to kill her 10 sec earlier and she would have lived. Yeah, probably. Alright, let's, uh... So these halberdiers... Okay, we need to we need to get Ike away from there, because he kills them too quickly. So we need to put Ike here, and then maybe, like, Gatry here instead, and that's how we're gonna do it. Surely Kyuso will level better this time. That was not my intention! That was not my intention, okay? I, I promise you guys. It's not my intention. The foreshadowing is insane. <laughs> Look, if we're gonna use Kyuso, this is what we're gonna have to do, okay? It's not... Up to me. It's amazing how every time something bad happens, the game crashes. Hey! What are you accusing me of here? Not cool. I will not tolerate such slander. Alright, you guys want some music or what? I'm waiting for some music requests. Oh, wow. Okay, so we're not gonna put Gatry in front. We're gonna put Mia in front, I think. Like so, yeah. Meng's loaded a save state so you can get a better, better key. So level up. I have been exposed, ladies and gentlemen. I have been exposed. Can we get the boss theme from FE7? Hmm, maybe. All right, guys. Let's see how this goes. Unicorn Overlord soundtrack. We could do that. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Please get a bad level up, Kisa. Please get a bad level up. Please get a bad level up. Oh my fucking god. I'm so sorry. Okay. Guys, I know how this looks. I know how this looks. I know how this looks. I do. I really do. Okay? I know it looks bad. But I promise you guys. I promise. This is not... This is not intentional, okay? The chat is so behind, really, is it? Chat, chat, you don't see he has a program open in the other window. No, He's no, tainted. No, no, no. <laughs> hey! Betrayal. Ultimate betrayal. Um, is the, is the chat? No, it's... Oh my god. I was, I was exposed by my wife. All right, let us uh, listen to some. Do, 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 do. Oh. Okay, this was the first thing that came up. This is the first thing I open. It's fate, I guess. Enemy AI in this chapter is set to drunk mode? Yeah, some of them are really weird. Like a minute delay? No? Huh? No. Alright. Okay. Alright. Let, let, let's test that theory. All right. Um, say clap when I clap, okay? Clap. One, two, three, four, 
five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seven. Oh wow, the chat is really delayed. What the hell? Why is it so delayed? Why? Why is the chat so delayed? That's so weird. I didn't set it to be delayed. Well, it's like 15 seconds, which is more than it usually is. Huh. Let me try, uh, let me try reloading it. Let me try reloading it, chat. It could be that if I, if I do this, that's weird. There we go. Okay, chat is refreshed. When you see when you see me say clap, say something. Clap. Say clap. Hmm. Oh wow. Oh. Oh no. What did I do? Okay, that's better, but Oh no. Uh what did I do? Oh no. Okay, I'm going to open the end screen. It doesn't mean the chat is over. I just need the chat info from there. Ah, oh, come on. Give me a second, guys. Sorry, I'm going to get I'm going to get the chat fixed. In a moment. <laughs> okay, so chat is a little bit better now. Okay, got it. <laughs> this is the taintest taint stream. Yeah, it's it's pretty bad. Oh my goodness, what is going on? What is going on? Is it because I'm speeding up Dolphin? I think it's because I'm speeding up Dolphin. I, I think that's what's... I think that's what's causing this. So, let, you know what? Screw it, we're not doing this. Because Dolphin is just dying. Give me a second, guys. I just need to fix this stuff. What's going on? Sorry, my computer is just being really weird right now. I'm okay, sweetie. Don't worry. I'm just yelling at my computer. Just blame your... Yeah, I'll, I'll just blame it on other things. It's fine. Uh, I'm a little bit worried about Mia, actually. I need to make sure Riss is nearby. I think she won't get hit by the fighters, but still, I need to be, make sure she doesn't. Hey, Manx, how's it going? Um, yeah, okay. Trying to speed up was not helpful at all, so let's, let's not do that. But I think chat has kind of fixed itself now, so that's good. <laughs> Flame wife, let's go. All right, here we go. I have my chat. My chat will be fixed very soon. There we go. That should fix it, yes. Ah, uh, it doesn't work. Okay, let me see. Uh, 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 uh. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. 
Fix the chat faster. Yeah, don't worry. I'm I'm work I'm working on it. I'm working on it. Well, we can we can we can put the music on again. Hmm. Sorry, guys. There's nothing more frustrating than technical difficulties when you stream. If you change the view to gaming and chat OBS. You need to access the... Okay. You guys are just... I thought you guys were giving me legit, legit advice. You weren't. Guys, be, just please give me a, give me a moment. I'm trying to fix my chat. It's weird. I know I got some donos. Sorry, guys. This is just kind of annoying me um, because I'm, I'm doing the fix. Yes. I'm gonna try deleting System 32. Mm -mm -mm. Oh! No. Oh! There we go! There we go! Ah! There we go. That was, that was very stressful. <laughs> I'm telling you guys, there is nothing more frustrating than being live and having to deal with technical difficulties on stream. Like, it is... It is and it's so annoying because you kind of... You feel bad because people are watching you and then you have to try and figure out... You, call, you have to kind of be quiet because you need to, like, troubleshoot. And then you try, you're trying to figure out what's wrong and then, you know, you don't... Yeah, it, it, it's, it's very annoying. Every streamer who streams will have dealt with this at some point. It is the worst, yeah, absolutely. But luckily I was able to do it. And now we got now we got the keys to train. Egg was hardball. I was annoyed, yeah, that was that was really annoying. I didn't like that. That was very, very, very annoying. Alright, so Kisa did get a good level up, guys. He did get a good level up. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. This is why you should have an unpaid intern control. I mean, <laughs> that's kind of what I'm doing. I mean, I have someone helping me. But, you know, I, I still have to fix the problem on my own and find and locate the problem, you know? I did kill Mist. I'm sorry, okay? I'm sorry, Jack. I got a better level up, but less use of miss staves. This is true. So, ladies and gentlemen, how far should we train Kisa like this, you think? What do you say? What do you say? Is Rodolf getting more experience than Kisa? He is, because he, uh, Kisa has Blossom, that's why. Looking well, 40, okay. Neither of the two are facing crit chance. Ah, uh, no, because Kisa has Daunt. So they should be fine. Bench Ike, you should stop? Really? Thirty experience. He gets what? Seven experience per per? La la da 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 na. 
buy a 490 graphic card to handle Dolphin. Honestly, I need a new PC. I've been needing a new PC for a while now. I really do. I really need a new PC. Six per. Okay, so how many hits are that to level up? There, are, these are some degenerates. The, that, this is how you level a goose. Imagine if those mages had bolting. I don't think there's any siege tomes on this map. Well, thank God for that. He does get strike rank. I am fairly certain. I, I think it's going up. I'm not sure. I think it's going up. 12 turns to level up. Okay. 17 turns. Okay. That is quite a lot. I might, I might honestly run out of heal staves before that happens. But if I can just get like two levels on Kisa, then maybe, you know, maybe, maybe we can make something happen here. I still have Citra on my PC. One does not simply get off the chain train. Look, when you guys dared me to train Kisa, I knew this was what I was gonna have to do. I'm not gonna like level him to max level or anything, but I'm gonna give him a few levels. I think he is gaining strike rank ever so slightly, I think he is. What does Daunt do? Minus five hit, minus five crit to everyone within three yards of units. I like it, it's a good skill. Kills should get them a bunch. Uh, maybe. I'm not entirely sure if they will, but we'll see. Okay, so now we got two mages, they need to die. So we do need to send Mia down here. With the XCOM sword? Oh my god, she got hit. That's not good. Uh, that's not good. What is your favorite DLC class in Three Houses? Um, I like the uh, the flyer, the dark flyer. Was that what's, what it was called? Pretty good. You think Mia will be okay against these guys? I hope she will. I'm gonna put Rom here just to try and keep her safe. I'm not training liar. One bad unit is bad enough, okay? I had Dawn on my Oscar and he was unhittable with an Earth support with Ike. Yeah, Oscar-Ike is a strong combo. That that works in, um, you know, that's always decent. Check Mia's biorhythm. Ha ha ha. Ah, shit. I'm just gonna pray Mia's fine here. She's probably fine. Untrain? <laughs> I wish you could untrain Fire Emblem units, that'd be nice. Yeah, Earth support is incredibly good, it, it really is. Alright, 48 experience for Kisa, guys. Let's see how this goes. Can't you just put the new computer as tax relief? So, I, I absolutely can. But, I don't actually have a, um, I don't have an LLC. I've been considering making one. But yes, you, you could, in theory, do that. You could put off the computer as a tax write-off. Did stream just get weird for anyone here, or just me? What, what do you mean, weird? Oh, let, let's check chat again. Okay, when I say clap, you say, you type clap in chat. Clap. Let me just, let me just see if stream delay is fixed. Oh, yeah, we'll read the donations. Refresh, you're fine, okay. Okay, there we go. Yeah, chat is back to normal. Chat is back to normal. There you go. Alright, now we can read some donations, guys. Now we can read some donations. I am totally gonna run out of heal staves, aren't I? Suck in a bucket, donut at five bucks, true super chats. Mengs, I'll have no more of this engage cope. The only redeeming thing about it were the soundtrack and giving me an Ike icon to use on my Switch PFP. I actually, again, just wait until the video comes out. I think you'll find that there are actually a lot of things to pray that, that engage deserves praise for. And I, I hope to bring up some new points that I don't think have been talked about that much. Um, Gabriel Burkut donated five rubles through Super Chat. 
Hey, Manx, what do you think about the Pepsi Max twist, the one with lemon? I think it's very good. It is, but they stopped selling it in Norway. I haven't seen it in stores forever. Like, like if anyone... Like, I've been looking for the Pepsi twist. I think it's delicious. I also like Pepsi Max Lime. And I also tried a new Pepsi Max in Sweden called Pepsi Max Raspberry, which is actually, like, delicious. But I've never been able... I see the lime occasionally. But but they, they also sold a Pepsi Mango, which was garbage. Which we'll do a little bigger. Oh, the one where I hate on Engage. Of course, everyone loves hating on Engage. All right, let's go. Hit points, speed. Okay, right enough. Okay. Six to six experience on Kisa right now. Uh, Werewolf donated fifty Mexican dollars through Super Chat. Eggy Weggy. I'd like to start doing YouTube comments and streams. Any recommendation for recording and video editing software as well as webcams? Oh boy. Um, so, I would say I use Camtasia. I think it's a great editing program, but most people stick with Sony Vegas. Sony Vegas, I've used that for years. It's absolutely fine. I just prefer the ease of use of Camtasia. But but Sony Vegas is definitely the go-to editing software that most people... It has everything you need to make good videos. So it's pretty decent. Um... As for recording software, uh, I use Fraps for heavy stuff. I think Fraps is, produces very good video quality. You can also record directly in OBS, but I don't think it is as good as Fraps. Fraps creates huge movie files, though. So if you're going to use Fraps, you're going to need an external drive with a lot of space on it. Okay. Also, I just realized that Ronald can die here if he kills the guy at 1 HP, so I should be careful. Yeah, Ronoff could kill this guy and take two hits, so I need to be very- that could be a game over, so I need to be very careful here. Clap. Um... Manx looks unsaturated? What are you talking about? I am very saturated, Oof. You take that back right now. I am a very saturated guy. Clap, delayed clap. I decided to stop drinking Pepsi when they decided to, to swap a third of the sugar with artificial sweeteners. Well, I don't drink the one with sugar, I drink Pepsi Max. It's not the same. Use your phone and Vault Ninja for a webcam. Resolve is a good free video editing software. Using OBS is fine for recording. Yeah, there you go. Sign, Sign is much better at this than me. I just ask him for advice, so. You know, whatever he says is probably good. Mm. All right, Kisa. Are we getting close? 90 experience now. 90 experience now, guys. 90 experience. It's the shadow the mic makes, I guess. Oh! Yeah, I have my mic pretty close to my face. I always do. Um, what about now? Is it better now? I, I guess not. Petition to call Ronald for Ronald? Okay. Oh! Oh, that's just a sword. Hit points, defense, resistance. Okay. Oh, let's go! Sto Soren staff rank. Alright, guys. I think this might make him level up. I think he's just gonna level up now. Ooh, let's go. I don't think I need to heal him fully, actually. Oh, one more, one more, one more. Michael Miller donated 199 to Super Chat. When did Mist die? Uh, she died before my emulator reset itself, and then I killed her. But um, I, I kind of messed up my wall. Okay, here we go. Now we'll get a case I'll level up. Let's go. What? What? No! What are you doing? You absolute buffoon! Attack Kisa, not Ronald. Why would you do this? There you go. That's better. The storm with the staff do more damage than Kisa. I don't think he will now. There you go. 
Oh, thank God. Here we go. Okay. Let's see what he gets. Let's see what he gets. Let's see what he gets. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. It's not tamed. That was a legit one. That was a legit one. Now, I'm wondering if we should do Kisa Oscar at this point, because Oscar just lost a support partner. And I don't know how long I'm going to use Ronald, but we'll see. Maybe, maybe I'll just keep using him. We'll see. It's not taint. Come on. Same level stats back to back. Yeah, I used my I used my my hacking tool. So what is he getting now? Five experience? I think he's getting five experience, right? The taint because you reset for the bad level. I guess so. Ronolf is like force force deployed for nine chapters. Yeah, so maybe I should just use him. Maybe I should just suck it up and use him. You know. I'm punching an aura to death. That'd be funny, yeah, wouldn't it? So doesn't uh, Raisin at some point, doesn't he gain like a thing that like maxes out Lagoose Lagu Cage? That actually sounds kind of funny. All right, here we go. Here we go. Watch Kisa punch a man to death, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go. The sword with the staff do more damage than Kisa? No, no way. Okay, let's check his strike rank. He is leveling up strike rank. Okay, so where's our next victim? <laughs> where's our Where's our next victim? Uh, let's go bring some. Uh, let's go bring some guys over here, shall we? We'll just kill the mages and the armor knights. Come on, Ike! Don't be like that. A strike strike is five extra damage, which that is actually huge. It is. All right, let's go and get let's go and get another halberdier and bring him up. Local halberdier gets punched in the face. All right, let's uh, we gotta kill this uh, we gotta kill this general first. No! 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 Wrong! Wrong! No! No! Ike! 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 No! Ike! God damn it, Ike! Ike! One, two, three. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so if we put Ike here. Ike is too strong. Okay, so now I need to disarm Ike and bring bring in the halberdier. So I need to do this. Oh, it's gonna bring a mage now, that's actually a problem. Um It's fine though. No! Wait, no. No! No, 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 I'm, <laughs> I'm stuck! I'm stuck! God damn it! Okay, um... Uh, or no, 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 okay. If I do this... Alright, now I'll trick, trick this guy into following Soren. Hunter Train, I think he won't do damage to a general. Okay, perfect, perfect, perfect. Perfect. 5% crit? What? Really? Alright, we just need to we just need to lure him in. We just need to lure him in. Did Manx just describe how to produce bodily excrements? What? What are you talking about? Alright, Kisa down here. And we'll create a little wall over here. And then Ike over here. And Soren over here. That's how we're gonna continue Kisa maxing right here. Ike faced 5% crit from the Thunder. He could have died? Oh my god. There we go. Beautiful, beautiful.
Okay, we have a new... We have a new Kisa Maxing strategy going on right here now, guys. The Tower of Kisa, that's what we're doing. Okay, Riss, you gotta, you gotta heal. I think that's actually enough. Yeah, let's go. One, two, okay, we're good. Why is Kisa's growth still on screen? I just figured, you know, since we're training him, we might as well show him off, right? All right, here we go. So I think we'll do this with one more halberdier and then we're probably done, I think. I ask again, what happened? What are you talking about? Oh my god! What do you mean, what happened? That's a very vague question to ask. Why not show his growths with Blossom? Uh, I don't know how to do that. Like, the growths are preset, so I don't know how, what they would be with Blo Blossom. Alright, we'll get one more level, I guess. Blossom sounds bad. It's half experience for double chance, at, for like around 50% more experience. So it is pretty bad, yes. There's no, there's no denying that it's bad. Mr. Mengs actually moved Getro away and forgot to move Mist. Yeah, I kind of blundered a little bit. That was a little bit sad, but let's be real. Mist was gonna die anyway. I was just kind of sad about her staves though. I think she lost the Hammer and Staff, so. Uh, if it's not on, did I? No, I still have the Hammer and Staff, thank God. Shouldn't he take Blossom off Kisa, then put it back when he goes to run 90? I mean, you can't do that. You can't take skills off mid-map. If I could, I would, but that's kind of abusable, but no. Keep Blossom on him. It doesn't affect bonus experience. You can use bonus experience to level him up to 99 if you want. It's about 50% better, because doubling your chance to roll a growth rate is not the same as doubling the growth rate. It's about a 50% better... It's The growth rates become 50% better, essentially. That's kind of how you can view it. Mm -mm -mm. How about countering the XP penalty on Blossom with Paragon? I don't think Kisa has the capacity to has have both Blossom and Paragon at the same time, does he? Uh, I don't think so. He has 35 capacity. Is that enough to have Blossom and Paragon at the same time? It might be, actually. Riveting gameplay? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Hey, you like it when I power level you in it. Don't pretend you don't. I feel 99% confident that... Blossom does in fact affect bonus experience. That does it now. He's just gonna die in part four. That's what you think, chat. That's what you think, chat. Right, here we go. Another Kisa level up. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go! Let's go. You want to do it again? Rip Glenn? That's an old reference. Magic skill? Honestly, this is better for Soren than it is for Kisa. It doesn't affect bo bon bon uh, bonus experience in this game. Right into down bonus experience, just guarantee. E no, no. I mean, uh, I think what Sev is talking about, does it increase the amount of experience you have to give a unit? Because I'm not sure if that's the case. It might be. Three houses, Glenn and Sacred Star. Yeah, I remember you guys were very sad when Glenn died. Glenn was so bad, though. He was trash. I think we can give Kisa one more level up, and then we can probably say it's enough. Maybe he's actually able to do something. Then he should level up his strike rank fairly soon. Yeah, look at that. He's very close. It's insane how much you have to grind that strike rank. Like you have to attack so many times. It's crazy. So, Max, how are you going to have handle the draw frame map? Yeah, I have no idea. It's going to be rough. I have no units. I, I guess it's just going to have to be a draw free solo. I mean, don't you get a Master Crown? So you can promote draw free at least? Kill off Ike and the Grail Mercenaries for Shadow Dragon Guidance Chapters. That'd be great. Normally, you get Strike Rank twice if you double. Yeah, I'm not doubling, so that explains it. Alright, there we go. 
it's gonna be fun. It's gonna, it might end the run, honestly. It might end the run. Okay. So this guy has how much defense? 22? 26. Yeah, there's no way. Joffrey Solo. That sounds familiar, yeah. He is actually pretty close to. So what we could do with Kyuso right now is we could have him fight a little bit normally. I mean, that could work, right? Manx is probably gonna lose Kisa. No! I put so much effort into him, of course I'm not gonna lose him. Manx will absolutely lose Kisa. No way! Okay. So I think it's- I think the time has come now. <laughs> has fallen for Kiso, the West has fallen, yeah, alright. Let's see! Ladies and gentlemen. Let us see if Kisa is actually good now, okay? What's their move? One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, okay! Alright, are you guys ready for this? Let's see. These are his stats right now. Okay, 28 speed, not bad. 28 defense, 28 strength. Not terrible. Not terrible. It's nerfy. He's not in range. Okay. Let's see how well Kisa does now after this training arc. I mean... It's kind of okay. 12 times 2? I mean, it's not terrible, right? Oh no. Grayson, no. <laughs> Grayson, careful, man. There is a fire mage here, but he by himself is not a big deal. No! Kisa is a tiger, not a cat. Liar is the cat, so. Look, he, he, he needs some help, but at least he can kill armors. He says a tiger pretending to be a cat. Oh, let's go. Okay, so Kisa just leveled up his strike rank. That's five extra damage, okay? Look at look at how much his damage output is gonna improve right now. Just just you wait, just you wait. Just you wait. Look at this, look at this, look at this. Yeah! That's what I'm talking about. That's a pretty big buff. Big boof. As DS Noon would say, is a big boof. No, it's S rank strikes. He he hasn't even begun the SS grind yet. That sounds kind of wrong. The the SS grind. Look at that though. Look at that though. Ow. Okay. That hurts a little bit, but it's worth it, guys. It's worth it in the end. Kisa and Ronald will absolutely carry this next map. Look at him almost dying. It was a fire mage, to be fair. No! Kisa. Ow. To be fair, it was... Yeah. <laughs> Let's give him some Oliver Grass. He'll be back in action, guys. He'll be ac back in action before you know it. Kisa training his Roman salute on the SS Grind. He does have a... He does have a Roman salute, doesn't he? The volcano should deal effective damage to tigers. I feel like it should, yeah. Alright. So we got more guys that I don't... Well, we got the Steel Longbow guy, I guess. Okay, let's try not to have Riss die. There we go. 
And now, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna have Kisa deal with these two guys at the same time. Actually, no, 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 let's, let's smoke some more weed. It is a very dumb map gimmick, absolutely it is. I think there's a random dark mage. Yeah, there is like one dark mage here for some reason, I'm not really sure why. One, two, okay, so we will do Kisa here. And look at look at the damage output he's gonna have right now, guys. Just you wait. L look at this damage output right now. It's gonna be great. 18 times tier relation, gentlemen. We're gonna kill the rest of this map with Kisa. That's what we're gonna do. Oh. Problem is, they keep on transforming! Okay, we're good. Kisa does- yeah, he's like a black tiger, which I actually think is pretty kick-ass. I actually think it's pretty kick-ass. Put Soren right here. Ronald can take an armor knight or two. That's fine, especially if we give him bliss. Rare time we enjoy by rhythm. Yeah, I know, right? And that's uh, so you can always just once your Lagoose are powerful enough, they actually kind of they can kind of like just take a couple. <laughs> What an idiot. <laughs> That's funny. Oh. <laughs> That's a great way to die. <laughs> That's a really funny way to die. But yeah, getting Raisin up to like level 35 and teaching him like the the, the Galdra that maxes out that maxes out the, uh, the Lagoose gauge? Actually sounds like a good way to make Kisa viable. Alright, let's go. The gen he did steal my experience. Damn him. Okay, these guys don't move, I think. What about this guy? Does he move? Let's go get him. Yeah, go get him. He's getting one experience per hit, guys. No, what? Oh my god, are you serious? Is he gonna do the same? Oh my- Hey! Stop! Hey! Stop it! Come on, why would you do this? Oh, the boss is moving now. Oh. They all charging now? Oh wow, okay, I guess that's like a zone based thing, isn't it? Oh shit. All right, let's let's retreat. Let's retreat. Let's retreat. Let's retreat back to some more. I kind of I worry about those mages. I really do. There goes the experience. Hey, I found a coin. Let's go. So will the boss just charge me now? Oh, I guess he will. Huh. I don't like those more dark mages, though. I gotta be honest. Those Dark Mary just kind of scare me. Is this a defeat boss or is it a route map? I don't actually remember. Oh wow, the volcano is like doing all my work for me here. It is actually a route map. Okay, I kind of don't want to take on all those guys at once. That sounds a little scary. It's a route map. Yes, it is indeed a route map. Well, I'm just going to let him walk through the volcano. Maybe I'll bring... Uh, I'll bring... I'll bring my units just in case. You never know. I don't wanna. I don't wanna lose all my units just because I'm so lazy and don't wanna move my units. You know. Better volcano. I will agree. The volcano map in Advanced Wars 2 is dog shit. It is dog shit. Okay, they they will probably just heal through the volcano though. So I don't really think it's gonna matter all that much. Ba -ba -da -ba 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 -ba. All right, I see we bring him back.
I say we bring him back. Uh, Advanced Wars 2. So there is a volcano map in the campaign of Advanced Wars 2, where you f where you fight Hawk with Jess, and it is such a tedious map. Oh my goodness, it is such a tedious map. I hate it. We do have to watch animations just to see the. Um yeah, we have to make sure this guy doesn't have crit on us. That's kind of important, actually. Yeah, he does not have crit. That's good. Wow, we do seven damage? Wait, does the strike rank also applies to unarmed? Wait, what? If true, that's pretty huge. Wow, it does? That's pretty wild. I didn't realize that was the case. Alright, well, uh, we have to, um, yeah, I don't like those guys, that's a lot, I really don't like, I think we might need Nephany for this, Nephany and Braum might be the ones, yeah, Nephany and Braum with the wind edge is probably what I need, let's, uh, let's see if their biorhythm is bad or not. Do you recommend someone who likes to play Fire Emblem to try Advanced Wars? You absolutely should. It's made it's made by the same company, sort of. Um, so, uh, absolutely you should. Because she, she actually has bad biorhythm, so we're going to fix that. With the Bliss. Ooh, wait. Braum has worst biorhythm. Let's fix that. Even Neff struggles somewhat? I think she'll be okay. Alright, comes the boss. Oh, he's going for Braum, okay. Eight percent chance to hit, let's go. I would recommend someone that plays Fire Emblem to play XCOM. Yeah, Norin guy, you you won't ever want to play XCOM, which is fine. Uh here comes the druids. I'm a little scared of this actually. Braum's resistance is not the best, and the druids can be a little scary. 16 hit, that's fine. I think they get doubled. They're pretty slow. I do not double, okay. Okay. Alright, I think we're good. Yeah, we're... Oh, wait, is the boss gonna die too? Oh my god, I thought the boss was gonna die to Volcano again. I thought the boss... Oh, cool, Kisa can kill... Can Kisa kill the boss? I think Kisa can kill the boss, guys. Ooh. That was a nice turn, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. I think Oscar needs to promote soon. He's level 16. Ooh, Nephany, careful. We need to heal her. Yeah, we're Kisa maxing right now. Strength on Nephany, let's go. Let's go. She has capped strength, ladies and gentlemen. She has capped strength. Alright, let's see if Kisa can heal the boss. Let's go. They're here, the subhumans! The mongrels are here! They want to conserve me! <laughs> That's funny. The mongrels. The mongrels are here. Let's go! Let's go! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's go! Let's go! I knew it would end up like this. Cap speed? Wait, his speed cap is 30? His speed cap is 30? He will never go above 30 speed? That's awful. I, I did get well, I do have Blossom on him download, so that's probably why. But, um... 
That was almost a perfect level up, yeah. So yeah, I guess Kisa will never double in the endgame, because... <laughs> oh my god. That's actually terrible. It does mean, though, that if we want to give him bonus experience... I don't know if it'll ever be worth it. Maybe it will, maybe it won't. Even Soren has a... Yeah, I didn't realize his speed cap was that low. I thought it was like 32 or 34 or something, but 30? So, he's gonna... Ha he cannot double... Can he double anyone significant? I don't know if he can. But... So what I want to know right now is whether or not... I want to know whether or not Kisa can... Um, I'm going to untransform him and we'll, we'll have a look. Oh no, that's a bad place to stand. I'm going to stand right here. Uh, he has what? Let's see. 15 speed. They do double him. Uh, maybe that was not my finest plan. I can give him the Dragon Slayer skill, I guess. Maybe that'll actually do something. I'm not sure. Kisa gets double. Yeah, 15 speed. Ashera doubles him. Oh, what? Are you serious? She does? Oh, no. So, does he do damage to Armor Knights now and transform? Let's see. Uh, he does, actually. He does 4 damage. But he also gets doubled, I'm pretty sure. Oh, okay. He T-poses? <laughs> he T-poses when he kills? I had no idea, that's so funny. <laughs> I had no idea. He T-poses. Alright, so if we can take out this archer... Kisa asserts dominance, yeah he does, even though it's... Okay, so if we can get rid of the mages, then Kisa might be able to grind on the armor knights. I, I don't know if he can get anything more out of it, maybe he can get strike rank, I'm not sure. I just want to get rid of that archer. But I don't know if he moves, so... Okay. Okay. What if I just unequip? Will they? Will they? Tr I just want to see if I can kill them. Uh. Okay. Okay, I see. So they, they are stationary. They are just completely stationary. Uh, uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay, so I cannot grind on them. Like, that, that won't work. Okay, got it. Hopefully, Nephany will be fine here. <laughs> Is Homo Tiger doing well? <laughs> Homo Tiger. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Homo Tiger. I don't know why that I don't know why that that cracked me up so much. Homo tiger. All right. Um, this is a little scary, actually. I I need to get go over there and heal them. I guess I could now. Uh... <laughs> Homo tiger. Oh my goodness, PH, you are unintentionally funny sometimes. <laughs> 
Yeah, I've capped speed on him, but the speed cap is 30, so... Uh, Nephany? Nephany? Uh, Nephany? Oh! I almost lost Nephany to lava! Holy shit! Ooh! But yes, I'll show you Kuso. Uh, this is him. PH, 30 speed. 30 strength, 28 skill. I mean, he's, he's coming along. It's been a pretty grindy chapter, but that's what you gotta do if you wanna use, uh... Homo Tiger. Um... This mage does not move. Does that mean I can just place untransformed Kisa in front of him? Almost lost Nef, yeah. Let me see, what's his speed? 20 speed. Okay, uh, here's a question. Do fire deal effective damage when you are untransformed? Uh, that's what I want to know. Probably not a good idea to find out either way. I'll just kill him normally. No. So I could have probably just punched him in the face, but oh well. Alright, we did it. <laughs> Homo Tiger <laughs> is, uh, is, is, is coming along really well. Oh my god, look at Ronolf and Ike. They're kicking around. I don't know why Ronolf is untransformed in this cutscene. It's kind of weird. He has five rests. Don't do that. Okay, alright. Well, I don't know how we got bonus experience for that. Are you planning on training Shinon? Not really, no. Like, his, his boat is kind of... His train has sailed, you know? Goldoa, the land of dragons, lies secluded in the southwestern... Can we kill off Skrmir, of bad unit? No foreigner, Laguz, or Bjork is permitted within its borders. Da -da -da, na, na, the alliance emerges na, from the lava na. tubes and into Goldoa by accident. The dragon king, Degincia, is displeased by this trespass. Trispus. However, Trispus. Ike's former companions, Nasir and Ina, appeal to Degincia to allow the passage of the Laguz Alliance. Raisin's actions during the last war earn them the grudging respect of King Degincia, who allows them safe passage. Now it's the, uh, yes, now it's the Joffrey Meanwhile, chapter, yeah. Anion calls off its pursuit of the Alliance and finds its passage into Gallia blocked by the nation's great mountains and deep forests. The Central Army's momentum breaks upon these obstacles like an ocean wave against solid rock. Senator Valtome arrives to Oh, it's Valtome, best Army. villain. He orders Zelvius to march on to Gallia by way of Crimea. Observing diplomatic protocol, Valtome petitions the Queen for passage, as well as supplies and additional troops. Queen Alincia, however, goes against the wishes of the Crimean nobles and resolutely denies each of Valtome's requests. Her reply enrages Valtome, who sees Crimea as little more than a vassal of the Empire. Ignoring Zelgius' counsel, Valtome orders his army to enter Crimea and take whatever they need from the villages along. Hmm, bad guy. Oh boy. Here we go. <laughs> it's gonna be bad, guys. <laughs> got three gear nets. <laughs> I have three units. Yeah, this Master Crown will come in handy. Might just use it immediately, honestly. I have three units, ladies and gentlemen. This is bad. At least I have both of my Paragon users still active, which is nice. Uh, let's see, how's Joffrey do? I think we just used the Master Crown immediately. He will need it this map, so let's just promote him. Time to train Astrid, I guess. I guess we have to, yeah. March is an okay unit. It might make more sense to put Paragon on Marsha, honestly. Because she'll be flying around and at least, like, doing something. P. 
pick bows. Wrong game, bozo. Yeah, I think we will uh, we will probably take Paragon off Astrid and put it on Marsha, honestly. Because, um, like, I feel like she would... Honestly, Nullify on her is pretty good for this map, but yeah. But we'll give Nullify to Joffrey, I guess. There might be some Horse Slayers on this map. Yeah, I'm, I mean, I, I I will need Astrid. I will probably need Astrid. Because I'll be needing everyone here, but... At least he can use bows now, which is nice. Uh, can he use longbows? He can, actually. I don't know if it, help him, if it helps him at all, though. Marshall's hair is a downgrade. Uh, I think Marshall's less cute. Yeah, I don't like I don't like her hairstyle. Astrid also looks weird in this game. She, her eyes are so creepy. I don't know what they did to her. All right, so I think we probably want a uh, we want another concoction. I think on uh, on Joffrey. I think a pure water on Joffrey might be good too, because there's mages on this map. So we have... Oh, we're definitely getting the Adept Scroll. Yeah, we're, get it, we're getting the Adept Scroll. I think we're going to put Adept on Joffrey, honestly. I don't think we need Nullify, actually. By the Shine Barrier? Eh, maybe. Maybe. She looks like Hinata a little bit, but Hinata is actually hot though, so. Um, let's see. So I think we will grab a. Anthony BM donated 69.99 bo bonus experience. No, wait, dollars. <laughs> Egg! <laughs> Thank you, Anthony. Oh my goodness. Anthony single handedly feeding my future family. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. So this short spare is likely to run out, so I'm probably gonna swap it with a javelin. I probably don't want. I don't know if I want this bow. The bow could be useful, maybe. Uh, the brave lance I'm definitely gonna keep. I'm gonna get a, f a healthy concoction. I feel like I should have. I probably should have another javelin, though. Because Joffrey's going to be doing a lot of true range on this map. Meme review? Yeah, we could do meme review. Hey, gay for Hinata. Oh, I thought... I thought you meant Hinata from Naruto. But yes... Yes, there is a... I forgot about Hinata and Fire Emblem. That's how forgettable... I forgot he was there. <laughs> Michael Miller donated $1.99. This is Shadow Dragon's level of abuse. Canadian Samurai donated 5 bucks. Manx, if you ever have a son, don't name him Glenn. <laughs> Michael Miller donated $1.99. 10,000 punch Kisa. Uh, let's see. So let's go open up meme review. Uh, we've been talking. Uh, again, I think I told you guys that if we have a daughter, we're probably going to name her Elise. Or Elisa in our region. As for a guy, I really don't know. Um, I thought about naming him Sigurd, but maybe not the best. Maybe not the best idea to name your son after someone like Sigurd. Uh, I, I don't mind the name Roy. I actually think Roy's pretty. But it needs to be a name that can be both English and Norwegian. You know? Anyway, we do have some memes here. Mm -mm -mm. Uh, no, I do not have a healer. I'm stuck to I'm stuck with concoctions. Although Joffrey does get soul. Uh, hello, Neo from Xenoblade Chronicles. Hello, Leth from Fire Emblem Radiant Dawn. I can't do that. Oh, she's a cat girl that can't transform. <laughs> what a cute cat. He, he reminds me of Tiger. That's funny. 
<laughs> That's cute. I do not get this reference. Is Kisa the name of a football player or something? When Mist dies and Kisa gets a bad level up and your game accidentally resets. Oh. Uh, Hi, my name is Heath. Hello to meet you. My name is Heather. This isn't a competition. Alright, those were the memes. Alright, are we ready to lose the run, ladies and gentlemen? We have three units. Should we get another javelin just in case? I feel like another javelin on Marsha, like in case. Joffrey's gonna be doing a lot of heavier lifting here, so. Joffrey's gonna be doing a lot of heavier lifting, so having extra javelins available might might be very useful, and we'll see. Alright, so here we got rescue villages, and we have to do this, I think, or we lose, right? Crimean army, it's three dudes! It's three dudes! Alright, let's do Lost Review. Oh, okay, Joffrey dies, so the villagers are only for bonus experience. Okay. Okay. Alright. Okay. Maybe Marsha can do something here. I don't know. Let's give her a Kilo Lance and maybe another Concoction just so she has some healing. Howdy, Noel. Okay, we have three dudes. This is gonna be tough. But we do have a promoter, Joffrey, who has soul now. So he might be able to do something. We'll see. He can't see us. What are you talking about? I can see you. Can Mengs get more healing items? I believe I can, yes. Alright, so we got a... Let's, let's see how bad Marsha is on this map. Ah, that's really bad. That is really bad. Um, if we put her here with the kill lads, maybe she can do something. I think Aster probably gets one round, so I'm gonna have to try and keep her. I have one Physic Bishop, I gotta try and keep him alive. The greenies will carry, that's what I'm hoping they will. They also put out fires, which is actually really nice. Oh no, don't tell me I'm gonna lose my bishop on turn one. Delayed chat? Did chat get delayed again? All right, uh, say clap when I say clap. Clap! One. Okay, all right, well, let me, let me fix that real quick. Let me reload the chat. Yeah, you're right. Chat did get delayed again. Is this a new YouTube thing? Are they just gonna start screwing with chats now? I'm so tired of this shit, man. Okay. There we go. Refreshing chat. I'm gonna have to do this. Alright, chat should be good now. Okay, say clop. Clop. Uh, no. Congratulations on the marriage, Mengs. Thank you. Oh, good. I didn't lose my... I did not lose my... Wow. This is what Astrid does now. This is... This is... This is the extent of her... Let's see. Does she take 11... 13? Yeah. So she doesn't survive this, so... Flop. Okay. Yeah. Chat is back to normal, guys. So it seems like YouTube now has a new problem. Chat randomly gets delayed. Lovely. I love I love that YouTube is just like randomly fucking up such shit. It is wonderful. Benyon committing war crimes. What else is new? Clopping? What's bad about clopping? Okay, Adept is so good on Joffrey for this mission. For real. 
Hey, stop burning houses! No, don't kill my bishop, please. No! He's my only healer. God damn it. Ugh. Alright, so we have to... <laughs> we have to do what we can to try and... Oh boy, this is so bad. <laughs> we have no units. We have no units. We're gonna lose every single one of these buildings, guys. Any of these have two ranged weapons? No. Hopefully, Marshall will be okay. I think those soldiers are the ones setting fire to houses. If we can kill them, we might be okay. I did do a lost review. Literally, the only way you lose this is by having Joffrey die. I heard the green unit is so bad. Care, Joffrey is far from invincible. I know. Oh boy. Uh, Astrid, get out of here. Yeah, I know. I know Joffrey is not invincible. Okay, if we can kill the soldier, I think we're in a good spot right now. There we go. Oh, Astrid is so dead. <laughs> she is so dead. At least I still have the calves running around. That's good. Hey, look at that. That's good. I love it when the greeniness help out like that. That's very wholesome. Man, Shinon's damage output with the double bow in the endgame is ridiculous. Don't underestimate him. Is it, though? Are you sure about that? Yeah, you can see Joffrey is far from invincible. It is true. Well, that was quick. <laughs> I'm glad I took Paragon off her. Very glad I took Paragon off her. Yeah, so here you can see things are getting a little dicey for Joffrey-sama. I think may not be such a bad idea to pull back a little bit here. Maybe give him the Brave Lance. Hope he procs some souls to heal himself would be nice. I think Marsha will probably die here, and I'd like to keep my Paragon if possible, so... 2% crit, that is just lovely. Yeah, this isn't really going that well. Oh, okay. Look at him trying to keep Joffrey alive. Why don't you put him in the bushes? Uh, because I wanted him to clear out all those enemies. And to be fair, Joffrey does a pretty fine job killing these guys. Oh! Okay. Let's go, Marsha. Yeah, that Greenian is probably dead. Okay. Let us indeed put Joffrey in the bushes, shall we? I don't know why I put a Horse Slayer on him. The Horse Slayer doesn't really do shit. The Horse Slayer does not do shit. All right, we're gonna risk, risk, okay. Um, okay. We have just, we have just Joffrey left now. We have just Joffrey left right now. This is the Joffrey solo mission. At this point. This is a drop free solo. Uh, let's get him into a heel hedge and let's just wait out the reinforcements. Hope he doesn't run out of what Yeah. Buy buildings. <laughs> There you go. The soul is important. Should I just rush the boss, maybe? 
Yeah, Joffrey has to carry this now. I, I'm gonna lose most of the buildings, I think. Yeah, I need to get him onto that heal hedge, so at least he heals a little bit. I don't think Joffrey's gonna die, guys. I really don't. I think Joffrey can solo the rest of the chapter. Oh! Do we give this to Joffrey, right? Or does he need it? Should we use it, or should we send it to Convoy? I feel like maybe using it would be nice. Might help him double. But we'd have to give off a weapon, though. Well, there's no mages here, so the pure water is kind of useful. Useless. Rush the boss. Maybe it's not such a bad idea to try and rush the boss, yeah. That's a lot of enemies he has to face, though. That's a lot. I could try. 41. No, no. Maybe it's a better thing to just try and kill the boss, yeah. Let's try. Give it to Kisa. He's kept. He's kept, my buddy. He's kept. All right, let's see if let's see if we can kill the boss, guys. All right, Joffrey has. Okay, these guys aren't very scary. He kills these guys pretty easily. Adept helps a lot too. The warriors, I'm a little bit more worried about, but I think it'll be okay. Give it to the Black Knight. Yeah, no, I'm using it. Also, chat is delayed again. So, yeah, this is just one one of like, if it's not ending my my stream prematurely, now it, there, we have a new problem with YouTube. In that it just randomly slows down my chat. Now I I love how YouTube just invents new live stream issues whenever I'm live. This is I've never in in all my like. Freaking like eight or nine years streaming. I have never seen this issue with the chat like just randomly gets delayed. I have to refresh it. YouTube, fix your garbage site. Oh my god. Stop creating new problems. Just say clap, yeah. Oh, let's go, Soul. Yeah. Rip green unit, you did well. Yeah, these fighters hit hard, as you can see right now. If I don't proc soul, I might be in prob- I might- might- I might be in problem. Better proc soul. Let's bring out the Brave Lands here. I'm trapped, actually. I- Help me- help me, Step Valthome. I'm stuck. I'm just gonna have- but the problem with soul now is that these guys don't have any HP. Which means that if I proc soul, I won't get any health. This, this green unit is the freaking MVP, man. Look at how many units he's tanking. He's holding up half the map on his own. What a champ. Oh my god, Crimea Cav. Oh, he stole the boss's concoction. That's actually good. <laughs> Let's go. I love it when I love it when enemies do that. That's so funny. Okay, this is a scary turn right here. I hope this guy heals himself. Um, I don't want to face all those promoted units at once. That would be very bad. So I think we go here. Heal yourself. Please, heal yourself. Oh, no. Crimea Cav. Crimea Cav. No. Oh, they're burning buildings again. Not good. Ah, oh, rip Crimea. Okay, that's gonna. Ah, that's a lot of enemies coming towards me right now. That's not good. I hope I can kill the boss next turn. Ooh, Joffrey, please be careful. No, Joffrey, please, 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 Joffrey. No, 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 Joffrey. No, please, no, no, no. Don't end another run. Don't end another run, please. Proxol, come on. Proxol. Joffrey. 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 
What are you doing, Joffrey? This is kind of tense. Um, I got four concoctions left. Uh, put him in front of the boss? Are you crazy? No. The boss actually hits hard. I need to get him in some kind of defensive terrain, I think. That's a lot of units coming my way, my goodness. There's a general in the way. I need to choke these enemies, I think. I need to go down to that heel hedge. Oh, Joffrey, please proc soul. Please proc soul, Joffrey. So, I could run away here. I could use the Brave Lance, and then I could run away, and I think that's what we're gonna have to do. Can you run out of weapons? Yeah, but I have a lot, so I should be okay. Okay, I've kind of backed myself into a corner here. This is not good. <laughs> oh boy. Uh <laughs> It's not over yet. I can proc soul and be very lucky, guys. Oh boy. If you proc soul, we're good. Oh my god, Joffrey. Proc soul. Come on. Stop fucking adapt. I don't want you to proc adapt. I want you to proc soul. Okay, he leveled up though. This could be good. This could be good. Hit points, skill, speed, and luck. Okay, that's a void. We should probably also pay attention to his bio rhythm, shouldn't we? Like, we should engage when he's high. <laughs> Can you stop getting hit now, Joffrey? This is starting to piss me off. Don't rely on soul? Well, I kind of have to, don't I? I think we can win this, guys. He just- Joffrey just needs to stop getting hit by everything! Joffrey, come on. Come on, dude. He just needs to win, somehow. There's a lot of enemies coming towards him. Archer. He needs to proc- he needs to- Oh my god, Joffrey! Stop getting hit! Oh, okay, I have three concoctions left. I could outlast these. If you just proc soul, if you just proc soul, that would help so much. Oh my god, he's gonna face a lot of scary enemies. To okay, I have an idea. I have an idea. I actually have a great. No way, this is a bad idea. Um, if I put him here and I give him an item that doesn't kill, the horse slayer is actually. No, it's. Is there any item that he doesn't want? Okay, I have an idea. Uh, I have two concoctions left. I take how much damage here? Nine. If I heal myself to full, I think I'm okay. Yeah, let's let, let, let's calculate. Does he have good bio rhythm? Uh, he has normal bio rhythm. So let, let, let's calculate. Nine damage. Nine, that's 18. 13. I think I'm good. Yeah, I'm good. That guy has a 1% crit on me, which is not great, but it's not the end of the world. Dude, I'm okay. I'm okay. I think. I don't think he dies. And if he procs a little bit of soul here... Oh, now he pro okay, yeah. Full health soul. Thanks a lot, Joffrey. Appreciate it. Appreciate that. That's that's when you need to proc it when you're at full health. 
Save those soul procs for when you don't need them. You may run out of weapon uses. I still have my bow. I think I should be fine. I'm not throwing, oof. I wasn't gonna put him in front of the boss with all those enemies there. He's planning on beating the boss with the horse slayer, maybe. Okay, now I'm getting some good RNG, finally. I think I can do this, guys. The enemies are starting to... No, the houses. I have one concoction left. These guys are healing on the bushes. Oh, nice, look at that. High ledge bow gaming. Hey, using high ground. That's what it's all about, right? I got a hand axe. I don't think I can use it, though. Alright, let's see how he performs against the boss. He does not double, the boss has a 2% chance to crit him, which is not great. I lost everyone except for Joffrey, he's the only one left at this point. But I believe... But there aren't that many enemies left at this point. There you go, got a bow cell. And this is fine, guys, it's not GG. I can heal with the bush, I can also heal with soul, so... Manx, if you survive this, I promise Shinon is so worth training. Oh my god. I I know you like Shinon, but it's a little too late for that. We're, on, we're almost in the endgame. I haven't given him a single level, like, I don't, I don't know what you want me to do. Only thing I'm sad about is that Marsha had Paragon on her. I probably should have taken that off her. Because Paragons are kind of important to have around, you know? Oh, you get a Steel Lance. That's nice. Oh my god. Are you... Are you shitting me right now? No way. 2% crit that kills? I am waiting until his biorhythm passes. <laughs> I am literally gonna wait. <coughs> I am gonna wait. I am not fighting the boss at good biorhythm. I'm not. I refuse. I'm waiting. Biorhythm finally became relevant, guys. It only took like 15 years. Okay, he's still on best. We're just gonna have to wait. <laughs> literally waiting for the boss's biorhythm to go down. I'm literally waiting for biorhythm. This is the dumbest thing I've ever done. <laughs> I'm waiting for biorhythm. Oh my goodness. Alright, we'll wait until it's at worst and then we'll engage. Bad biorhythm. Worst biorhythm. Is he still critting me? God damn it, he still is critting me. And the crit will kill me! And the crit will kill me. So, this is it, guys. This might be how I lose my Iron Man run. A 2% crit. 2% crit. This would be a great way to go down. This would be a great way to end my run. Oh, thank God. Oh. Oh. I did it. That was absolutely terrifying.
11% hit, 2% crit. That would have been a way to go down. Minus 40% hit, yeah. So Joffrey was able to solo chapter 3-9. Now we know. Now we know he can. I'll be right back. After Alencia's meeting with Valtome, the Crimean royal knights returned to the capital of Melior, leaving the border villages between Crimea and Gallia completely undefended. The Benyan Central Army crosses the border once more, but Crimea makes no move to march against it. Valtome sees this inaction as a sign of Crimea's capitulation to Benyan's demands. The Benyan forces occupy the Crimean castles and forts on the border with Gallia and prepare to launch their attack. The Laguz alliance finally makes its way back to Gallia, but word of Benyan's approach allows them no time for rest. The news that Gallia's ally Crimea has allowed Benyan to travel through its lands comes as a great blow to the Laguz alliance. That's nice. Just put it here. Oh, that's fine. You can put it here. If it's not in front of me, I'm, I'm, I'm going to forget to break it. Just give me a glass. Thank you, sweetie. Look, my wife is trying to prevent me from drinking Pepsi. She's bringing me water. I can probably just drink from the... Yeah, okay. I don't need a glass, sweetie. I'm just... I'll just drink from the... From the... From the can. Mm-hmm. Ah, uh, yeah, I'll just drink for like this. What? <laughs> Subhuman. Oh my goodness. <laughs> All right. Lion King theme, let's go. Yeah, chat is delayed again? Yeah, what else is new? Let me just, let me refresh it. Ah, <sighs> YouTube. Fix your shit, man. At least this is not as bad as just, like, ending. It's not as bad as, like, ending my chat randomly, but it's it still is very annoying. But every time I refresh it, it does seem to work. Yeah, there we go. Clap back again. Oh, a cider assigned for Kisa. Let's go. Which chapter is this again? I for gore. That's not a can, that's a pitcher. Okay, snob. Alright, let's do some supports here. Kisa ran off. There we go. Anyone else? I think that's probably it. Mm -hmm. Oh, Rayson can uh, su uh, Rayson can support with someone. Maybe he'll just do Oscar if I can do that. No, I cannot. Okay. Uh, hmm. Honestly, I kind of want to do Kisa Oscar for a void, and then I could do Oscar Rayson. I think I'm actually... Or I could do Ron Ulf Rayson. I don't know. We'll see. Oscar... Oscar Rayson might be better, honestly, to keep him safe. We'll see. This is his first time drinking something out of a can. Give him a break, Chad. Hey! Hey, shut up. Just for that, I'm gonna open a monster. Hey! Hey! Put that down. Put it down. <laughs> Sigma male. All right, uh, meme review, let's go. Ah, oh, Hell the Moon memes. I live for Hell the Moon memes. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Radiant Dawn Ledge in a nutshell. <laughs> That's a good scene. The 
yeah, Joffrey would be like, except Joffrey don't use swords, but you know, nitpicky details. <laughs> yes, this is how you trade, Kiza. This is how you do it. <laughs> oh, that's kind of sad. That's kind of sad. Joffrey is all alone. All right, so uh, let's get Kisa up to 99. There we go. We're gonna continue blossoming him up. Now, um, let's see, so we could, no, we almost have no bonus experience, so we're just gonna save the rest of it for Kisa. Daunt and Blossom, I think we'll keep him on him. I don't think we have any other s other skills to really play with here. Um, yeah, this is fine. I honestly, I I would I wouldn't mind getting to use Smite on someone. I'm not really sure who it would be, but like, someone who can actually utilize it, like Ronald, for example, might be able to utilize Smite. For the most part, I and Alinsha's army should be combined. Yeah, I think they'll be okay. Oh, we can forge. With 1,400 gold. Okay. We don't really have any money, do we? We, we don't. <laughs> we have no money. Honestly, we need heal staves. And mend. Honestly, I might just get two heal staves instead of one mend. Because it's just more efficient. And I'm kind of low on money. And I think Riss and Soren will be able to heal fully with the heal staff anyway, so it should be fine. Yeah, it would be nice if you could sell the Satyr sign. I don't know why the game gives you so many Satyr signs. I feel like it's almost a meme at this point. Like, why? The money man was right, yeah. Money is important. Alright, I don't remember this map. Which one is it? Oh, it's this one. Oh. It's this one, yeah. Oh, this is where Alinsha is like, hello. Hello, everyone. Could you please stop fighting? And they're like, no. No. And then there's, like, this weird sexual tension between Tibarn and Alinsha in this game. It's so weird. He's like, Arr, you're, I like your spirit, woman. Ooh. I like it when you talk like that. Like, seriously, just read the dialogue between Tibarn and Alinsha. It's so weird. I wonder if it's the translators taking some liberties here. But he's, like, he's like all excited by her. He's like, oh, I didn't know a human woman could have so much authority. Ooh. My army, it's Joffrey and three dudes. <laughs> My army is so small, it's just Joffrey. Wait, why is Lucia here? Didn't I kill her? Or does she come back in this map? Oh yeah, right. This is okay, so am I completely mistaken here, guys? Or can Alinsha die on the first turn? Wow, yeah, it's literally Joff. And I actually messed up. If you unequip Joffrey in this map, you get a free Brave Lance. Okay, I, I get, uh, yeah, okay. Lucia with short hair is different from Lucia with long hair. Is she a different unit? I thought it was just a portrait change. Hmm. Honestly, this is fine with me. I mean, I guess I could bring Shinon. I don't know who I'd bring, though. I think I kind of want everyone here, so. I need more, um... Actually, I don't need Master Crowns, do I? I can just level people up normally. <laughs> Insert Shinon Copypasta. Where do I have my hammer? Who has my... Who has my hammer? Because in this map, the hammer will actually be kind of useful. Um... Yeah, Titania has it. Okay, good. Mm -hmm. 
la 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 Yeah, so we gotta go rescue Alinshia, that's very important. Should be fine, though. Alright, let's go, guys. Are you gonna give Ike a hammer? Uh, I don't think Ike really needs it. He probably one-runs generals anyway. So I think I'm okay. Oh yeah, we gotta do a loss review here. This is important, thank you. So, Ike, Ronulf, or Alintia is gonna be game overs here. That's right. We're not messing around with Kisa this time. We're transforming him. La da nyong. <laughs> yeah, let's go. Yeah, so whoever you put on the front lines here needs to be. I think Rob and Nephany will handle this part. Oh, I don't have javelins. Are you serious? Where are my javelins at? Yeah, Trey, give her some javelins, will you? Thirty speed Kisa is so bad. It's kind of sad that his speed cap isn't higher. I will admit. Joffrey got all my javelins. That's where they went. Actually, Oscar has two, so... Yeah, we gotta go get Alinsha. She's gotta link up with Joffrey's army. That's kind of important. For now, 30 speed is more than okay. Yes. Yes, we need... It should be okay. Go. Let's get some grass. I need I need more olive grass. I'm actually kind of running out of, of olive grass, and I I kind of want to get some grass on Ronolf as well because he is partnered with Kista, so it'd be nice to get him transformed. <laughs> yeah. So this is the part where I think Elincia has like a small chance to die. I don't remember specifically, but I think she has a very small chance to die. Alright, look at that! Kisa one running. Let's go! What does Lucia have for gear? Not much. She has like an iron sword and a silver sword. It's not great. Oh, there we go! Kisa level up. Let's go. Okay, what does he get this time? Hit points? Bless you, sweetie. Strength, skill, luck, and defense. So pretty much everything except for resistance. So, not bad. La 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 la. Yeah, Brom, Nephany. They will carry this side of the map. Everyone else can go north. Should be fine. Is Kisa good? Um, we'll see. <laughs> oh, there we go. Joffrey has his horse slayer. That's actually not bad for this map. Yeah, lots of green units here. We're gonna get some bonus experience thanks to them, and they're healing Alinsha, which is good. Do they turn blue when you talk to Alinsha? Oh, hey, hey, Lavelle. Uh, they do not turn blue when you talk to Alinsha. I don't think there's any point in talking to Alinsha. If I remember correctly, I don't think it really does anything. But I will put Kusan Frontier. Oh, I should have given him a healing item. I think I still can.
I'll put, put him in front like this. Mengs gets two free healers with those two bishops. Yeah, if you can keep them alive, that is. And that is a big if. Alright, let's train up uh, Brom's sword rank a little bit here. Oh, it would be nice if you could get their staffs. Yeah, that would be epic, but that is sadly a little hard. Uh, it's so annoying when you play the Dawn Brigade, like the chapter where you fight against the Dawn Brigade, and then, like, Loras, like, starts using your own physics staff to heal. That's so annoying. It's happened to me a couple times. Alan died Brom? It's probably gonna happen, yeah. Speed. I got speed on Riss again, guys. 20 speed. Let's go. Let's go. Our Ronald is Ronald's gonna transform fairly soon, I think. I don't think there's any need for us to. I think I'm gonna go heal Oscar. Let's go heal here. And we keep Titania here with some hand axes, and let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. Okay, going for Oscar. That's fine. Why do unit camp their stats in Radiant Dawn so quickly? I think it's a way for them to balance the game. Uh, they kept stat caps rather low to ensure a single unit won't, like, spiral out of control, you know? At least, I think that's the case. It's difficult to tell. Don't is actually helping out pretty well here. No, Crimea Green Unit, no! How you get hard killed? That was like part two, yeah. He died against Dudwek. Oh, right! These units have siege tomes, I remember now. Is Kisa really speed cap at 30? Yeah, I did not know. I, is that the universal tiger speed cap? Do you guys know? Because I'm not sure. You go, yeah, I, I, he died the same way. I have a tendency to repeat my mistakes. I'm not really sure why. Might be because I don't learn from them. Or might just be. I'm actually just trolling. I'm actually really good at Fire Emblem, guys. I'm just trolling for content. That's my favorite. That's my favorite Meng's conspiracy theory. So that I'm actually really good. And all the mistakes I make are just trolling for content. Because that implies I'm really good at Fire Emblem. Alright. Oki and Janoff are ready to join the battle. Was Mengs trying to train Meg? Uh, I did in my last run, but I decided not to this time. I just didn't see the point. I just did not see the point. But that's just a theory. A Mengs theory. You learn a little bit because Neff isn't dead. Well, Neff is actually pretty good in this run, I, I will say. I'm, I was a bit surprised. I don't usually use Nefany in Radiant Dawn, but uh, I've gained a new appreciation for her, I guess you could say. No, what the f- <laughs> Hey, that's not what I wanted you to do, Okay, what the hell? <laughs> I, was <laughs> I wanted you to kill him, not shove him. We got a bunch of dudes over here that we got to deal with, and uh, let's bring in the Sora. Death by shove. Nephany has decent caps. Yeah, she she's okay. She's not like amazing, but she's okay. Her strength is a little low, but it, 
The thing about Nefane is that she's fast enough to double a lot of the enemies. I think she's fast enough to double Auras, which is actually pretty nice. Alright. Oh, I think I capped speed on Ike. That's good. La 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 la. Oh, Kisa one-shotting. How far is he away from getting SS strengths? Let's see. It's gonna take a while, probably. He's like 20% of the way. Yeah, that's gonna be rough. Bully maxing. <laughs> yes, we're bully maxing, guys. Look at that. Nef can one round both kinds of dragons. She's like top 10 units. Um, maybe. I don't know. Not if you include the Lagoose Royals. I don't think she is. If you don't, if you, if you, if you do top 10 non-Royals, maybe, maybe Nef can earn a spot there. Otherwise, I don't think so. All right. No, no, no. Oh! Isn't there like a crossbow that can kill a Lynchia over there? I gotta get rid of that thing. ASAP. I'm pretty sure there's a crossbow that can that can kill a Lynchia, so I gotta be very careful of that. Luck on Braum. As if he's capped most of his other stats, so I guess that's fine. Wishblade goes... No, Gatry can... Uh, I don't know. Probably use the Wishblade. I don't know. We'll see. La 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 la. Gave Omer for a crossbow? Yeah, that'd be a, that'd be a repeat of prior events, wouldn't it? Luck is the best stat. It's the first statement I made on this channel. It's still true to this day. Neff might be bad, but I love her anyway. That's fair. You're allowed to have your... You're allowed to have your... Uh... Oh, what? No! What? No! Uh, shit. That was not what I meant to do. I did not mean to revert. You can tell I don't often use Lagoos. <laughs> it's okay. He had a Lagoos stone. Thank God. My friends don't always have the discussion. This unit is bad, but events are amazing for us. I mean, Fire Emblem is a highly subjective game. Because of growth rates, so one if you get a blessed Neff, then yeah, you'd probably think she's good. Once you start playing Fire Emblem more, you learn the difference between like when a unit is just blessed versus when a unit is actually good. I know that sounds a little elitist. You should just use stop caring about Fire Emblem, guys. You should just use whatever units you like. But if you want to be objective, which of course is really, you know, no one likes being objective. Mm, I'm objective in a single player game. <laughs> Fuck off. I need to play this 20-year-old uh, single-player game objectively well. <laughs> nice, good job. Alright, there's a lot of enemies here. This run is subjectively tainted. Maybe your mom is subjectively tainted. Have you thought about that? Got him. I know. Can't really say anything to that, can you? Ah, it's time for Kisa to kiss himself. No, it's that didn't really work. 
It's time for Kisa to become the... 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 F the, the... 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 Misa? I don't know. Play it how you want to play it. Wah! It's Kisa... Kisa time. Yes, let's go with that. Ultra Homo Tiger. The Ultra Homo Tiger. I don't know why I think it's so funny that PH calls Kisa Homo Tiger. It's just a funny name. Pizza? Kisa wants some pizza? What are they doing? Oh, they're all going towards the unit. Okay, what, what are they doing? Why are they just gathering around? What? What is that? Did, did, did Alinsha tell them to like group around her or something? I think that must be it, right? <sighs> Captain Ronald, I'll cover you, but no, I won't be able to protect you unless you stay very close to me. A good call. If we watch each other's backs, we'll be unstoppable. I bet you want to watch Ronald's back. Greeniness have to... Pr oh, they, they get like a special AI to protect the Lin Show, because that's what they're doing. Okay, I get it. Uh, actually, I kind of want to send Oscar down there and help. <laughs> no hetero moment. Alright, go get him. Get him, Oscar. I don't want that guy to run up and, like, kill Raisin. That would be very bad. Alright, we're slowly moving forward here. They are protecting Alentia. It's important to protect Alentia. Very important. If you don't protect Alinsia, very bad things will happen. La la la. Uh, it's it's an Andron Saga inside joke. Uh, PH made a map for Andron Saga, chapter 16, and uh, he didn't know how to put small text on the objective. So the objective was protect the villages, because it was cut off by the screen, and we kept it like that for a while. So it was just protect the villages. Uh, don't kill my sword now. There you go. Oh, wow. Oh, he's using a staff. That's so funny. He's using a staff. That's so funny. Oh, great steel lance broke. I need more equipment. Can I get some money, please? No. He did adept with the staff. That's good. So here's the question. I actually don't know if this is true or not. Do you get staff rank for hitting someone in the head with the staff? I don't know. I've actually never thought about that before. You do. Okay. So you can train your staff rank by hitting people in the head with a staff? That's actually really funny. Also, I really want the bishops to start healing. Yes, I kind of have to advance forward here, because uh, if I don't, I'm going to be screwed, so. It's more wind all over again. Let's go. Alright, so I think we'll do another olive grass here. We'll trade it to Kisa, I think. Yeah. <laughs> Make priests fight to get experience again. I kind of liked in FE1 when... Um, it's kind of cute in FE1 where they just got experience for surviving. That was kind of interesting. Ah, oh, let's... Uh, Fix biorhythm of the green unit. This is the best. This is the best way to use your heron, right? 
Is Ronald still a game over condition? He is, yeah, he is. So I gotta be careful with him. We don't want him to untransform randomly. That would be very bad. Ah! Let's kill some of these priests. Has your opinion on Kisa changed? Uh, not really, no. I mean, I mean, I always knew that if you tainted him, he could become more decent. Just because he has slightly better growth rates than most Lagoos, and I put Blossom on him. So, I always knew that if you tainted Kisa, he could probably get to a point where he can kill enemies, but that's not really saying that much, is it? I mean... He lost all but Joffrey because Joffrey died. Was a defeat condition? He was forced to survive, yeah. You gotta be very careful with Joffrey. He's a lot more frail than you think, sadly. Hmm. I, I skipped Donvar Kalud. I forgot to recruit them because I started a Lynch's Gambit before looking at the base. Or I went to look at the map, and then I went back, and that takes away your conversation. Oh, Ronald, what? Uh, is this gauge gonna run out? Oh, that's the hammer. If Ronald's gauge run out, that could actually be kind of bad. He's got- he's a cat, so his gauge does run out pretty quickly. I think we're good, though. Uh, Dunbar, I just lost. Yeah, he died to a uh, he died to a knight, I think. Mengs, I stumbled across an old con uh, comment of yours for seven years ago. I didn't know you were into pro wrestling. I watch wrestling from time to time. In fact, has WrestleMania happened yet? I don't remember if WrestleMania has happened yet or not. But uh, yeah, I watch wrestling from time to time. I don't think wrestling is as good now as it used to be. They dodged a crossbow? They did? That's funny. Oh, the Iron Sheik passed away recently? That's sad. He was he was great. Oh, that was a crossbow. <laughs> I didn't even realize. That's cute. Thirty-eight. Thirty-eight hit though. It's not that bad, PH. Come on. Like, I've seen worse, you know? Oh boy. I gotta be very careful here. Man, Kisa's damage output is low key kinda great. Like, once he gets his strike crank up. He deals a lot of damage. I mean, look at this guy. He does 40 si si 7 times 2. He needs 10 more levels before he can get the Saturday sign, though. That's kind of bonkers. Alright, Ronolf is now untransformed. 16 speed. He doesn't get doubled by the general, so I guess that's okay. Is it 30 for Saturday sign? Okay. Well, that's good. That's better than I thought. That's much better than I thought. Dang, this live. Indeed, he is. Why is Astrid so good in Path of Radiance, but absolute trash in Radiant Dawn? Uh, it's mostly because most units in Radiant Dawn are trash. Because this game has such a massive roster and it tries to use all of them. And there's not enough experience to go around since on hard mode they just cut experience gains in half. And this mess, this mess, this, this like really caused problems for most of the staff. Because there are a lot of units in Radiant Dawn who are good if they get a little bit of experience. But experience is so scarce. It's hard to justify giving experience to all your units. There's some units who are fine on their own, who are just can just kick ass from the start, but there's some units who needs like a couple of speed level ups to get going. 
And they are very, very, uh, they are hit extremely hard by Radiant Dawn's hard mode experience there. I hate difficulties that cut experience gains in half. I think it's the laziest way to balance Fire Emblem. It's not fun either. I didn't like it when Treehouses did it. I think you get less on Maddening and Engage as well, right? Uh-oh! Oh, shit. Oh! 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 Oh no! No! No 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 Oh my god he doesn't get doubled Oh he doesn't get doubled he doesn't get doubled Oh shit oh shit please no 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 Oh he's fine Oh my god I almost came over it I almost lost Rano I almost lost Rano Oh my god I almost lost Rano Oh, wow. I almost lost Ronald. Oh. What? Heal! Oh my god. That was very scary. Ho <laughs> ho That almost... That almost ended the run. Runoff almost ended the run. If that bow knight had one extra move over Kanto, yes. Yes. You are absolutely right. Anyway, we have Super Bird with Race, and I really need to set up a Super da Bird dance here. Um, not gonna lie, I wish there were a mod for Radiant Dawn that brings back Weapon Triangle in enemy range. It's literally called Make Hard Mode Great Again. It's a mod. You, that exists. It's part of the randomizer. Uh, but you what you can do is you download the Yune randomizer for Radiant Dawn. And then it, you can choose not to randomize. And you could just enable, uh, add weapon triangle and movement ranges back to the game. And you can just plus randomize. And you now have a Radiant Dawn ROM that has weapon triangle map. Uh, it also allows you to, to include the map uh, affinity thing. It, it, it's just a toggle called Make Hard Mode Great Again. So, it's, uh, it, it exists. And I actually contemplated using it for this run. But I did a vote on it, and people said no. Because they wanted, like, I guess they wanted, like, a legit Iron Man experience or whatnot. So, uh, yeah, no, it does exist. Can someone make a unit replacement that can randomize any GBA hack? Uh, it exists. It's called the Unit Randomizer. Oh, any GBA hack. Actually, that's being worked on. Uh, so, Shizuka told me that someone has made a self-randomizer that actually works on ROM hacks. I haven't checked it out yet, but they've tried it on various ROM hacks and it actually works. I'm going to try it on Andoran Saga and see if it works. Ready for the bridge map? Hell yeah. Always. All right, Ike is capped now, I believe. Indeed. So this is my capped Ike. Strength, skill, speed. Ru yeah, this is pretty pretty standard Ike, I'd say. Mm -hmm. 
All right, that was almost disastrous, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> that was almost disastrous, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, I like this scene. This is where um, Cell just chokes that both home. Oh, do we miss it? Choke him out, choke him out, choke him out, choke him out. Choke him out. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> this is a cool scene. I like this scene. 7,000. That's not bad, actually. That's pretty good. So, just simp mode activated. Let's go. Apostle Sonaki arrives with the war, memes during this intro. Army's main camp in Crimea. With a strength born of conviction, she exposes the senator's vile plot to undermine and usurp her. Valtome counterattacks with a claim crafted by the Senate that the Apostle is a fraud who, along with her Prime Minister, Sephiroth, is attempting to deceive all of Benya and lead them away from the Goddess's graces. To the citizens of Benya, the Senators are chosen by the Goddess and are worthy of the same respect given to the Apostle. As for the Apostle, her image is tarnished when the Senate imprisons Prime Minister Sephiroth in her name. An ever-growing number of Benyon citizens are willing to believe the senator's claim that the apostle. Is Seriously, an the funny thing of though, the senate is kind of right. Sonaki is a false so apostle. Micaiah is the real divided. apostle. One camp so in the apostle you know, the Benyon senate is all like corrupt and you know bad and this all that, but they're actually kind of right in their claims. Sonaki cannot hear the goddess. Australia. She literally is a fake apostle. So. It's kind of funny that we're like, oh, how dare they? And I was like, no, they're actually telling the truth. <laughs> they were the ones who put her there? Yeah, but they did, did they know she was fake? Senators were the real heroes? Yeah, all right, let's do meme review. Oh, they knew she was a fake apostle. Like, I actually, actually forgot that bit. You're a Sigma because you choose to be. I'm a Sigma because everyone else is dead. We are not the same. <laughs> Send dudes, you mean nudes. I'm in a fight. I need more men. <laughs> yeah, that's my death counter, all right? You sent in the death counter as a meme? Okay. Mang's death counter, what the hell is this? <laughs> Unit dies in their battalion. <laughs> uh, what's this? Please just join the army. I will be. I will give you an irresponsible amount of gold. So you'll have to catch me first. Okay. I just rescued this small child and conscripted her into your army. Now I need to bring her to the other side of this castle and keep her. Get her to talk to the deadly assassin and convince him to join too and keep them both alive. Also, watch out for lightning. This is actually pretty good. You're going to have to go out into the desert and stand on the spot in the middle of nowhere. Why would he do that? Just trust me on this. Hi, my name is Old. Do you want me to join the army? Okay. <laughs> okay, uh, it's awkward zombie. Yeah, these are good. Uh, lawful good. You can't copy, copy me, but I'll stay after class. Neutral good. Uh, no, nah, I hate these so much. Ah, uh, I hate these. Like they're always super bad. Okay, so let's 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 take a look at this. Okay. All right. So, um. Okay.
Oh boy. All right. I know that this is a meme, but let me just... Okay, so let me... People, I don't think I've ever seen a good alignment chart with Fire Emblem. I know that this is probably like a bad joke, but let me just... Let me just... Let me just tell you why you're wrong. I don't know if you made this or if you found it, but every time I see an alignment chart, they're always wrong. So, lawful good lion. Yeah, probably. I mean, I'd probably classify him as neutral good because lion has shown that he's willing to break rules and tradition. Like, he experimented on his stones despite the fact that everyone told him not to. So he's clearly okay with breaking law, breaking the laws. So I think I actually would put, I would classify Lion as chaotic good, not lawful good. Erica is definitely lawful good. She's like, follow the rules, protect people. She's, Erica is classic lawful good. Erica is much more likely to follow the law. She's very like, res she respects authority. Ephraim being coded good, yeah, that's a good alignment for him, because Ephraim's definitely like, fuck the rules, I'll do what I want, but I'll fight for the, I'll protect the innocent. Uh, Kyle being lawful neutral, yeah, that's a good alignment for him, he's kind of like the harsh, judgmental one. Ford being true neutral, I would probably classify him as chaotic good. Ford is much more a chaotic good kind of character, he's a free spirit, but he's very good. Uh, Joshua is also chaotic good, he's a good guy. He's definitely not neutral. Joshua has a, has morals, but he doesn't care about the law, so he would be chaotic good, not chaotic neutral. Ross being lawful evil, no. <laughs> Ross is probably neutral good. Colm is not neutral evil. He's probably chaotic neutral. I'd say he's very like he's he's kind of like do do whatever he wants. And Kaylock is not chaotic evil. He's neutral evil. I'd say because he doesn't want to. Kaelic doesn't kill for the sake of it. He kills... He kind of does, but he he has no qualms about killing, but he doesn't just like to burn people. He kills for a reason. Okay, I know it's about the text underneath, but I just wanted to... Every time I see an alignment chart, people always fuck it up and it annoys me. Lawful is following a pretty defined. It is inclined to respect laws and traditions, but may not follow them. Uh, there are more like like being lawful means you respect authority. It means you follow. You generally speaking, you follow a code of conduct, and you it you can deviate from it, of course, but it's not likely. Oh, money! Thank you. What? No support. Can I not do racing? Where's racing? Did racing leave my party? I guess he did. Ah, there we go. Who are you going to promote to third tier first? Uh, do we have master crowns? Yeah, we do. Uh, well, I can't use it, so. Hmm. Ooh, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Get it get it closer. No, no. Oh, cinnamon rolls. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna be dead at 40. Oh. She baked cinnamon rolls. Uh, Alright, who should I? I? I guess Titania, maybe? Or Braum? Honestly, Nephany. Nephany's capped almost every single one of her stats. Or Mia. Hmm. Alright. Could do Oscar. What do you say, chat? Alright, we need more, uh, we need more javelins. Oh, wait. Uh, let's see, okay, and then how many hand axes do we have? Seven? Probably, like, we want to have, like, ten. And then I need, uh, I think Ike is gonna get us Ragnall soon, right? So that's good. Um, let's go check out the shop. What do we have here? Oh, yes, we're getting all over grass. <laughs> oh, yes. Thoron, I don't think I'm gonna get that one. It's 
Do battle experience on Ephony? Well, we're gonna get keys up to 99 first, and then we'll see. Alright, do we have any skills? We have Discipline and Nullify. Uh, oh, wait, is, has Joffrey joined the team yet? Oh, no, he doesn't join yet? Okay. Because that, that Paragon would have been very nice. Um... So we have Nullify. Nullify, Nullify, Nullify. I don't know... Discipline? I don't know if there's anyone who still needs to train their weapon ranks. Maybe... No, Brom, everyone's pretty much maxed out their weapon ranks already. Why do you call it battle experience instead of bonus experience? I really don't know, Hanako. It's just kind of like a thing that happened. Ooh. Oh. 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 <laughs> I kind of want to do this, guys. I kind of want to do this, guys. Oh, I could give Kisa so many levels. Okay. I mean, who else is going to get it? Okay, okay, you know what? Screw it. Let's do it. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> he gets skill and luck. This is so bad levels. This was a very bad idea. <laughs> he got strength. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, he's cap. Skill and speed. <laughs> what a waste. He's very close to getting the Saturday sign now. Great use of battle experience. I don't care what anyone says. Oh, nice. We're getting some items now. That's very nice. What have you done? I think he works. <laughs> Cap skill and speed for the win, am I right? Do Oscar Shinon support? You won't use Ileana anyway. That's a, actually a fairly good point. Yeah, I'm not used. Yeah, I could do Oscar Shinon. Sure, that's fine. Uh, there you go. That's pretty pretty all right. I I'd say. He's got six to six HP. It's not bad. Remember that you cannot use Raisin for the bridge. Yes, I'm aware. So, do we just... Do we Nephany Master... Do we give Nephany the Master Crown? I feel like Gatry could also benefit from the Master Crown. Honestly. Uh, either Gatry or... Braum can probably get some more strength and luck. Should we give Nephany the crown? Alright. Let's give Nephany the crown, guys. Alright. Here we go, guys. It's what you've all been waiting for. I don't remember her um, Sentinel outfit. Da 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 da. Okay, she looks badass. There you go. She looks like a blue lobster, she does. So 29 speed, 28 strength, not bad. She gets a really cool shield, yeah she does. That's a pretty good Nephany. She's gonna cap pretty much every single one of her. She's gonna cap every. Let's give her discipline, why not? 
Nef so, uh, Nullify. I think... Who should we give Nullify to? That's a good question. There are Ballistas on, um... There are Ballistas on this map. We could give, uh... So if I... We could give it to, uh... Oki or Janaf and use them to kill crossbows. Yeah. We'll give it- we'll give it to Oki, and we'll use him to, uh, we'll- Actually, Oki is likely to dodge crossbows with his, uh, avoid. So, I'd say we give it to Janoff, and we can use him to, like, target fire crossbows. He won't take any damage from them. I bought- I bought the grass. Yes, I bought the grass. Alright, I say we give a- let's do a forge. Um... Let's do a forge, shall we? Who should we forge for? Which one of the, uh, which one of the, uh, Ike is gonna get his, uh, Ragnall soon, and he's also capped, so probably not that important. I say we forge for... Brom has his Atlas. Maybe Titania? You get Sigurd and Tanith next map. Maybe you get them, if you get them for preparations. Maybe you get them for preparation. Oh, that's a good point. Let me, let me see. Yeah, I think they don't they join you. Oh yeah, you do get the Ragnall in this chapter. Yeah, you do. All right. Yeah, we do. We do get the Ragnall. And does he promote? I don't remember. Yeah, here we go. All right. So uh, we got two new units. We got Sigrund. Uh, aside from being pretty, I don't. I think she's probably one of the worst units in Radiant Dawn. She's okay. You can promote her to uh, Seraph Knight with a crown if you want. She becomes okay. Um, she has very low speed growth, which is annoying. Does she have any good skills? No, not really. She can do a triangle attack. So that's kind of cool. Yeah, he promote. Okay, right. But so she's a nice filler unit, I guess. If you need, if, if yeah, she's she's an okay filler unit. Tanith, uh, she's worse than Sigrun, and she doesn't summon, uh, she doesn't summon green units anymore, I believe. She's a much better strength growth, though. But it's kind of sad she lost her reinforce ability. I kind of, that's, that's kind of sad, honestly. Does Sigrun have a 10% defense growth? I guess she does. Yeah, she does. That's really bad. Mm, yeah, you do get Sigrun and Tanith here. That's good. That that means we can give them some javelins and whatnot. Honestly, since I cast a Ragnall now, we can give them some. Uh, we can give them some of his swords. We will never use anything but the Ragnall again. So. Can they instant support? I don't think so. Never heard of that. No, they cannot. But they are a good candidate for supporting, for sure. Alright, Yamatoko. Good job not starting Season 7, Egg. Good news. In other news, tomorrow I start GMing my Pathfinder Drug Draw Generation 2. The goal? To get revenge on the former PC that turned on them for Deadlord Powers. Now Anguilla. Ah... Good, best of luck with that. Let us know how it goes. I think it's cool that you're DMDing a drip draw campaign. Sam Brown, under 499. Hey, Mangs, did you know that if you put flying units on pitfall spaces before they open up and have land units walk through, the pitfalls will activate? I know. And I'm never gonna do it. Oh, shit, I didn't. Oh, my God. Who did I bring? Uh, I didn't bring Janoff and Oki. <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> uh Ike, Ike Ronolf, Sigrun or Tanith. Okay, fuck that. I'm not I'm not moving them anywhere near ballistas. Oops. That was kinda dumb. Yeah, I kinda forgore, guys.
Yep, this is gonna be bad. Easy game for Ballista Boys. We're just gonna have to take it very easy here. Oh, I didn't bring Janoff and Oki. That's terrible. I didn't bring Titania? God damn it. I forgot to do deployments. But it's an Iron Man. I can't look. I can't go back. Yeah, the pitfalls here can be very deadly for sure. You gotta be careful. You gotta be very careful. At least like us Ragnar. Yes, he does. Ooh. I think you can use the Restore Staff to clear stun effect on guys. Can you not? Did I bring the Restore Staff? I don't remember. And these guys will actually rescue, which I think is kind of funny. Can Ether trigger from 1 to range? I think it can in, in, in range, yeah. I think it can. I don't remember, but I think it can. Oh, we got new uh, battle music. That's cool. Alright, I know you guys are excited for Nefani, uh, Nefani's new animation, so let's... Uh... Your flyers can deactivate the traps. Yeah, but that involves me moving my flyers into ballista range, which I'm not going to do. Magic luck, okay. Please, Composer Sun, give us another map theme. I'm going insane. Yeah, this map theme has been going on for a little too long, I will admit. Oh my god, look at Kisa's damage output right now. It's actually pretty good. Ooh. Unless the weapon naturally has that range, it won't activate class abilities. Okay. Okay. Nephany. Here we go. Sentinel Nephany, ladies and gentlemen. Are you fighting against Dane troops? Uh, no. I think we're fighting against Benyon, right? Oh, no, we're fighting Dane. Never mind. Yeah, we're fighting Dane. In Radiant Dawn, it's half skill instead of full skill. Yeah, but it's also affected by biorhythm, right? So, uh... Yeah, you're fighting Dane now. Yeah, we're on our way to Dane Keep. Get out of here, I gotta heal Kisa. I should have brought my restart staff. Yeah, I really should have brought my restart staff. This was kinda bad. I'm not bring I'm not moving Sigurd or Tanith anywhere near this shit. They're gonna die. And they placed on light runes, which I think is kinda funny. Yeah, when you're in good biorhythm, you get 10%. That's probably why they nerfed the activation rate of Aether, I think. There is a movement trigger that spawns Leanne and Tibarn. Yes, I am aware of this. I'm gonna move forward very, very slowly. I don't remember where the pitfalls are. I won't look them up. Because I ain't no coward. At some point, we will fall into them. It's inevitable. I'm gonna try to do it with my generals, though. Because they have such high defense, they'll probably be fine. Nephany and Aaron, both to the tower. Oh, that's right. Oh. 
Careful, Oscar. I might bring Nephany. Okay, yeah, yeah. So this is one of the reasons why I may not bring L uh, Royal Lagoose to the tower. It's because I want to bring the units I train, not just units that are already good. So maybe we do no no Royals in the tower, I, except for Kurt Naga. I will train Kurt Naga because I think it's so fun to train him. Oh, right, they fling rocks. At some point, Tibarn is gonna show up, I know that. No Royals is kind of hard. Yeah, but it's also fun, so... Yeah, you're right, it is fun. Okay, here we go. Ah, here we go, Tibarn has joined the battlefield, ladies and gentlemen. Now, if I remember correctly, can't I just... I cannot. But it was worth a try. Bring Gifka, he's no royal. I might bring Gifka, I think I transferred him, so he should have four extra strength. Magic, skill, defense, rest. I miss my Raisin. If Raisin ever gets a girlfriend, do you think she'll call him his li her little Raisin? I, I think I think I think she will. Do, do, do. Honestly, no. I think we will do. Oh, here's Leanne. I completely forgot about her. Hi, Leanne. Welcome back. Uh, is it a lost condition if she dies? Tibarn is actually a lost condition on this map. So you want to be a little cautious, because I know there's a couple crossbows here that I think could do a number on him. Oh, I'm going to support Race and all. We're using Oliver. Wait. I can't get Oliver. I can't get him. Yeah, I can't get Oliver. Tibarn isn't transformed. He will transform. You can get Raphael back for part four. Real? Oh, right. You're right. Yes, you are right. You are right. He will join. So we can get Oliver. We can get Oliver. What happened to Raphael? I thought I lost him, but he came back. Anyone else think that these two Hawks should have been replaced by Oki and Janaf? It's kind of weird. I feel like they were maybe supposed to do that at some point. He's hanging out with Donatello, Michelangelo, and Leonardo, yeah. Curse, donate five bucks to Super Chat. Fun game, take a shot of Pepsi every time Mang says ladies and gentlemen. But I only say it at the start of my video, so you would just take one shot of Pepsi. Are you implying I should drink less Pepsi? I mean, I feel like they should just not be with Tibarn. I guess, I don't know. Ooh, I got a sil silver great lance is a very inaccurate weapon. You need a lot of skill to use that thing. If I remember correctly, it has like 50 hit. 50 hits 17 might. It's such a dumb weapon. Aw, oh, I didn't bring my hammer. Sad. There you go. Brom continues to level luck. Silver Great Lance on Nephany. She can kill with regular. I don't really think she needs it. Hammer hit rate? Hammer hit rate isn't that bad in this game, is it? Or maybe I misremember? 
Oh, okay. There was a pitfall right there. La 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 la. Your hammer is click. My Kiso one runs armor knights now. He actually one runs uh, one runs armor knight. Could I request you train Tanith? Um, the problem I have with training Tanith on this map is that is that if she, if she dies, it's a game over. As up, and there's ballistas here. Although the ballistas are rock chuggers, I think, but there are still there are still a lot of crossbows on this bridge, and I'm kind of scared. So, look, PH, the game uses like runes. They're copying uh, your map. Isn't the hammer the god tier weapons to take down the Black Knight? Yeah, you can give Ike a hammer to just bonk him immediately, but I will not do this. Oh shit, that's a pitfall. Oh no. I will not use I will not do this because I Oh shit. That's bad. I will not do this because uh, I am going to use the Black Knight chapter to train um to train Kurt Naga. Fuck! Why are there so many pitfalls here? <laughs> if you hover over a ballista, it should tell you what ammo it is. Yeah, so here, yeah, so they're both this. Yeah, so it's, it's actually just Rock Ballistas here. That's actually... That actually makes it a lot more tempting to use Tanith and Sigrun. I still have to, have to be careful of crossbows, though. Wow, T-Barn is going ham. I'm kind of worried, guys. I know there's crossbows over there. Bro <laughs> is playing Excavator Simulator. Let's go. So when, uh, when units are stuck in a pitfall, they actually get zero void, which can be a bit scary. You know it's a pitfall when it falls into three while claiming his brilliant strats, yes. Chucked a rock at the barn for one damage. Why are you letting Tibarn go forward? Oh, I can. Oh, that's right. I can direct him, can't I? I probably should, shouldn't I? I don't know if it. I don't know if the crossbow kills him, but uh, it's probably best not to risk it, right? Yeah, he's stealing a lot of my kills. The crossbow one-shots him. Okay. I will tell him to not do that then. Let's avoid. Wow, am I just trapped here? Oh shit! <laughs> he just untransformed. Wait, how am I supposed to move forward here? The light rune is preventing me from moving forward. Gotta wait out the light runes, okay. Carry them over with flyers, that's actually not a bad idea. If they could pick up anyone. Run away to barn, please run away.
I bear bid this fucking tiger for th three hours. These are better than Cinnabon. Yes. These are these are better than Cinnabon, my goodness. Well, I tried. I tried to use Kisa, guys. And you know, we'll we'll never forget the times we had. We will always remember what could have been. All that bonus experience! <laughs> yep. But you know what? Oh, my goodness, these are good. Mm. Mm. Oh my god. Mm. What the? Oh my god, those are good cinnamon rolls. My goodness. I forgot all about Kisa already. Kisa, who? Well, that was a good run, guys. At the end of the day, the, the real Kisa was the Kisa that died in a ditch somewhere. That was a bit unfortunate. But, uh, you know, these things happen, guys. It's an Iron Man. You see, I'm fine, because I don't care about fire. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, wow. We have to use the big death counter now, guys. I don't want to use the big death counter. Can this light rune go away? Like, seriously, can this light rune go away? There you go. Ah. Can thieves disable light runes? I don't think so. No, I don't believe they can. We also lost Daunton Blossom. Yeah, that was very sad. Time to level up Liar, let's go. Yes, this is clearly what we need to do right now. Where'd Tiburn go? Oh, the other guy died, okay. <sighs> yeah, I think it might be a little too late for Liar, guys. I'm sorry to say. I don't think you should, uh... I don't think you should expect Liar to be used anytime soon. Let's just put it that way. Next is Leth. Yes, guys. Absolutely. That's what we're doing. So yeah, I need to find a uh, I need to find a new unit to try. I need I need to find a new support partner for Oscar. 
I don't really know who that would be. Oh shit, that was not what I meant to do. Uh crap. Uh oh boy. Tanith is in range of the crossbow. No, is she? One, two, three, four. How is she in range of the crossbow? One, two, three, four. I don't see her being in range of the crossbow. Yamatoko donated 110 euros. Train liar if she dies, game over. You want me to train liar? Now? Oh my goodness. Oh wait. Oh my goodness. Wait. Oh, is that not Tibarn? Is Tibarn in range of the crossbow? Uh. Uh. Oh, thank you, sweetie. Mm. That's so good. Um, isn't there a crossbow right there? Oh, it's going for Mia. Whew. No, no, that's not potato salad. Um, my wife has baked cinnamon rolls, and they're really good. They're better than the ones we had at Cinnabon in America, and Cinnabon is really good. They're insane. All right, we have to kill this guy. God damn it! Mia might have just saved my run. Yeah, she might have. So I'm gonna re I'm gonna keep these two. Can they can they rescue each other? No, they cannot. But so I'll just keep them close together. Got it. Mm. Oh my god. When will Mikaya show up again? Uh, there are two more Dawn Brigade chapters. I think, uh, isn't 312 a Dawn Brigade chapter? Why not just order Tibarn away? Um, good point. Yeah, I think we have two Dawn Brigade chapters coming up. It's so sad that you're running around with Grail Mercs in Tier 3, and there's still some Dawn Brigade units that are Tier 1 when you get back to them in Part 3. It's like, they're so underleveled, it's not even funny. It's so sad. It is so sad. It is the saddest thing I have ever seen. But yeah, I'll tell Tibard to fuck off now, so... He doesn't get himself killed on a crossbow. That can happen. It's annoying when it does. Yeah, even on the lower difficulties, the Dawn Brigade sucks, and they're even worse on hard mode. Hmm. 
I'm gone for an hour and Kisa dies. I feel bad. I feel very bad. But, um, he got stuck in a ditch and then he got doubled by a mage. It was very hard for me to do. I should have not have sent him first. Since I'm not that heartless, I'm also fine with either Leth or Liar going to the dust. Leth is even worse, though. Dawn Brigade needed another chapter. I think they probably intended to give them one, but they ran out of development time. I, I think Dawn Brigade... Honestly, I think the Dawn Brigade was intended to maybe have as many chapters as the Glow Mercs in, in Act 3, so that you could level both of them up at the same time. Instead, they get, like, three. Which is really bad. Uh, I don't think the rocks can kill, can they? Oh, yeah, actually, no, they definitely can. Mangs, the power of Red Dono compels you, or have you no honor? How do I level Liar at this point? Like, are there enemies she can hit untransformed? I... Like, I, I can try, but it's... I don't know if it's possible. I mean... I, I don't know how I would even do it. Because, like, I ne she needs to be able to damage things to, to gain levels. And I lost Blossom, and I don't have Paragon either. So I don't know how I'm supposed to train Lara. I think her damage output... I'll, I'll, I'll see if it's possible, but I have a feeling it's just not doable. <laughs> if you didn't dump six levels into a dead tiger, yeah. Well, hindsight is twenty twenty, as they say. Um, I tried, okay? I tried. You can grind on a priest in part four. Yeah, I guess I have to. Oh, hi there. Yeah, I guess I will. I guess I have to. I think a blind man could have foreseen that Kisa would not be worth all that. I wanted to try, okay? I wanted to see if he could be good. To be fair, his damage output was pretty good. Like, he was able to one-run Armor Knights as a Tiger, which which is pretty impressive. I mean, there's not many... There's not many physical units without a hammer that can one-run the General in Radiant Dawn, so... I will say... Not terrible. But... Pretty bad, <laughs> at the end of the day. What did you learn, Manx? I learned that anyone can become good with enough special treatment. But that not everyone necessarily is good with special treatment. But it was worth a try. Using a non-royal Lagoose is a night I, I just wanted to see, you know, because he's like literally a unit I've never ever used ever, so I figured I could give him a go. And you know, he does he and Lyra they do have good growth rates for a Lagoose. It's just that you know, you have to kinda taint the game to get any benefit out of them. Also I could have transformed Leanne. Did you have fun with Kisa? As much fun as I could have had, I guess. <laughs> Luck resistance. Yeah, Radiant Dawn is a game where 
the Royal Lagoon's reign, and everyone else kinda is fighting for breadcrumbs. Did you know that the Silver Polax is more accurate than the Silver Great Lance? That makes the Silver Great Lance the most inaccurate weapon in Gradient Dawn. Yeah. I don't know what they were doing with the... I don't really know what happened to the to the Silver Great Lance. I think maybe it's a stat error. Maybe they put in 50 instead of 60 hit or something and they forgot to change it. But it's interesting, actually. Have you seen that the enemy snipers can promote in this map? The enemy snipers can promote? What do you mean? Um, I know that the boss is a marksman, yeah, but... It's not a big deal, I think. Imagine if you had transfers on Tanith. I think it's very hard to get transfers on Tanith normally unless you give her stat boosters, right? Alright, so it's a cease map, so. Let's uh, take him out with Mia, shall we? If enemy sniper uses a ballista into a unit with level 20 and 99 experience, the enemy sniper promotes- Oh! Yes, I have heard of this bug. Yes, 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 I have heard of this bug. Yeah, the, the, the enemy promotion bug. Yeah, it's pretty funny. Yeah, you can make a sniper, like, promote to a marksman. It doesn't have any, like, useful purpose, but it's funny. They get dead eye. That's funny. Yeah, that's funny. All right. So we need to uh, Akar. How do you pronounce that? So what I need to do now? I'm gonna ask Tibard to come over here. So I need to. Uh, so let's see. What kind of supports are we gonna do? We're gonna do Sigrun and Tanith, Obviously, we're gonna keep them next to each other to level up. Oh, you get a bit more experience. Yeah, that's a good point, Ephraim. Okay, so Ronolf lost his boyfriend, which means that we need a new support partner for Ronolf. Um, I don't know who. Oscar, maybe? He's got Shin on C, I guess. Hmm. Well, everyone else kind of already has a partner, so I guess it's just those two, really. Any more missions? I kind of want to do the Dawn Brigade mission, honestly, because it's a lot of fun. So uh, you do get you do get support points from being adjacent to each other, right? Because I kind of want to get Sigurd and Tanith. I kind of want to get them supported up with each other. That way, they become a little bit more useful in the end game. I didn't kill Kisa. The fire mage he torched him. Shovel so increases support. Well, they can't shove each other, so it's hard to get them to support. Liar, Ronald, really. Ronald, Leon, support. Hmm. I guess. How common is fluent English at your level where you live? I'd say most Norwegians speak fluent English for sure. I'll just rescue her. Most Norwegians speak fluent English. 
some doesn't. Like, the older generations may speak it a bit brokenly, but they still speak it. Not the worst idea. Leon Ronolf avoid is good. Yeah, I guess. And they're forced to avoid anyway, right? So, yeah, giving Leon some more avoid it sounds like a good idea. Huh? Oh, I gotta seize with Ike. Alright, it's time for the Dome Brigade, guys. Time for the Dome Brigade. Oh, the dono. Oh, I skipped it, sorry. Al Baker, dono to five bucks. Thoughts on Radiant Dawn style, great axes and great lances and axe where weapon weight is offset by con instead of strength? I am considering these for mine. I mean, we literally did that with Amaran Saga. We had great swords, battle axes, and uh, great bows. And I think, I think the more weapon variety you have, the better. And I think having heavy weapons that benefits, like I think a good way to balance a burly character, a big character with low speed is to give them big con and let them use like battle axes without losing speed. I think that's a good idea. Oh, hi, Peleus. I'm not going to get you. All right. Oh, boots. Let's go. 10,000. Okay, I can never remember who we give the boots to. Oh my god, I haven't seen the Dawn Brigade forever. I haven't seen the Dawn Brigade. I'm okay. Jill is dead. I started to break it to you guys, but she's dead. Saber on Toronio, I guess. Um, honestly, the Master Crown on Toronio is not a bad. It's not a bad option. Could also give it to Laura to level her up immediately. Or Aaron, honestly. Honestly? Aaron. Ooh, we have a speed wing. Um, why don't we just camp Aaron speed out and promote him? I mean, he's probably gonna cap speed anyway, isn't he? Although, I feel speed winging Micaiah might make her less likely to die. Aaron is super, so he's got 24 speed. I feel like if I give a speed ring to Micaiah, I might not lose her, and she might be able to see some battle. Aaron is going to cap speed no matter what. Like, he's he's fine. We're going to crown Aaron. We're going to crown Aaron. That's the best way to go. He'll still double everything in this map. Let's go, Aaron. Ba -ba -ba. Da -da 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 -da. So how does he compare to Nephany? I think he's uh, way tankier than her. I think stronger? But I think he's slower than her. Mm -mm -mm. As for the boots, I really have no idea who to give them to. Um, I guess I could give them to Aaron to make him move around faster. Uh, I could also give them to Micaiah to give her more mobility. <laughs> Aaron doesn't get a thigh window. Preposterous, I know. Oh, he still has Beast Fall on him. That's cute. Um, you could save boots for later. Not a bad idea, honestly. There are many characters who could benefit from boots. Mm -hmm. 
Does Laura still have her physic? I think I actually have Paragon on Laura, don't I? Yeah, I do. Yeah, I'm considering maybe putting it on Aaron if he can use it. Hmm. Oh, we have another Master Crown. We could. We could promote Laura to Saint. That would be kind of funny. Master Crown Seahawk? Ooh, that's not a bad idea. How's the stream going? Going pretty well. Okay, so... I think getting a True Blade would honestly be pretty good for this map. So I think we're gonna do that. Kisa died, yeah. Sad. Yeah, I think we're gonna crown Seahark. Let's go. Yeah, I need to give him swords. The next map is the uh, cliff map, where you attack from cliffs. Yeah, I'll do memes after this one. Um, all right, let's go see Hark. But yeah, he <laughs> he really needs he really needs wind edges, like three <laughs> wind edges for see Hark. There you go. Now, now he's good. Uh, same thing with Aaron. He needs javelins. Let's see what they're selling uh, in the shop. Do they sell physics staves here? I don't remember. Ooh, the tusks. The beast. I don't think the beast killer is that valuable at this point. But I think I'm gonna get a recover for Laura because it's. Hmm, let's get a mend for her actually. Oh, she has a lot. She'll be fine. That killing edge is about to break. I could get him a new one if they sell... Oh, they yeah, they, we do sell Killing Edges here. There you go. Ah, uh, do we just bench Edward and Leonardo at this point? What are they gonna do? Nothing. I'm also considering taking Paragon off Laura. And giving it to Aaron, maybe? I feel like he probably could benefit more from it here. Because he's going to see a lot more combat. And Beast Foe doesn't really make any sense here. Uh, Soth might need a range dagger here, actually. Yeah, he does. Yeah, the music is wonderful in Talius. It's epic. Alright, let's get him a iron knife. Wow, I am low on cash. Can we sell it? I could sell the boots, but nah. Sell the Reaper card, they're completely worthless. Oh, uh, that reminds me actually. We're gonna take uh, Wild Heart off Volug. Because it sucks! And I don't like it. Beast Phone Leo to get some extra damage, but there are no Beast Lagoose in the next map. I'm fairly certain, so... Ah, oh, do we do Steel Life? Let's do a Silver Knife on Soth. Silver Knight. 
silver knife on self, and then a steel knife probably. Wildheart allows Valug to shapeshift shittily. And it doesn't allow him to shapeshift indefinitely like it did in the first so one. So it's kinda shit. And for that reason, I don't want to use it. Don't forget to give don't forget to give Toronio weapons. I will not forget. Toronio, if you don't promote him, I find that he kinda falls off pretty hard here, but he can still do something. Alright guys, let's go. So Waldhar is a worse demiban, yeah, pretty much. Yeah, I will keep Fiona for rescuing, but she's she's probably going to die. Alright, so uh we wanna do You can use the rocks here if you want. I don't know if it's very good, but you can. You know what? Screw Fiona. She's just gonna distract me. Yeah, this is the Aaron show right now. The Aaron and Seahawk show. That's what this is. Yes, we're gonna do defeat conditions, which are... Mikaya, Soth, or Toronio dies. So you want to be a little bit cautious with Toronio. If we don't promote him with a Mastercron here, he can actually die. But use the high ledge and you should be okay. I checked for supports. Yeah, I did. And I, I like to send Mikaya and Soth over this way. And then I always put Toronio right here. And then, ladies and gentlemen, it is time for a sweep. The Aaron sweep, if you will. Ho 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 ho! He doesn't one round. It doesn't matter though. He doesn't need to. He has Impale. Finally a different song. Yeah, I was getting very, very tired of the old one, for sure. Seahark, we need your support partner over here, don't we? Yes, we do. Wow, okay. I mean, we, at least we can shove rocks at them, right? There you go, Leo. <laughs> you can tell the units not to get involved, but I figured, why not? Doesn't even one round with a crit? Yeah. Welcome- oh wow, okay. He just wants to take all the experience. Honestly, you could tell the green units to step back here. It's not a terrible thing to do. Remember, you need to train Leo. Do I, PH? Do I really need to train Leo? How am I gonna do that at this point? My tier 3 units can't even one round. I think I might just ask the green units to step back, so my other units can get the kills. Oh look, it's Sonic's little carriage. That's cute. Wait, can they move through there? Wait, 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 wait. Did I mess up? 
Is, there, is that like a point where they can move? Okay, no, they cannot. That's good. Tell them not to move. I'll tell them to avoid so they get out of the front lines, and then I'll tell them to stand still. The Pegasus Knights are a little annoying, though, so I do like to tell them to kill those. Wow, good job, Toronio. You're an exemplary unit. Look at all these enemies, man. That's crazy. Gotta be careful so Mikaya doesn't die here. Um, yeah, we gotta kill 36. Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of terrified here by these guys. One, how much speed do they have? 20 speed. Do they do they double Mikaya? No, because the speed wings. So Put Soth in front of her to protect her. And then we just gotta churn through these units somehow. And now he procs Impale. Okay. Why avoid? Uh, because I want them to pull back. Ah, why not? It's experience, I guess. Lost Review is uh, Toronio, uh, Mikaya, Soth, so I gotta be careful here. You know what? If I bring a couple of, uh, if I could bring a couple of Pegasus Knights up here, maybe Leonardo can kill them. Maybe. Yeah, run away. And then I'll tell them to halt. I just wanted them out of the front lines, basically. <laughs> they surrounded them! <laughs> they surrounded them, that's cute. That's really cute. Form up. Surround them all. Don't let us sing. He doesn't kill with a crit? What the hell is this? That's a lot of red. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. There you go. Now we're getting some impales off the ground. There you go. Aaron's impaling is- Oh, let's go! That's like five impales in a row. Yeah, the wind edge- Oh my god, six impales in a row. What is up with this guy? Careful with the ledge, they can climb up. Okay. Oh shit, they can, yeah. Uh oh. <laughs> Dane, wow. That bishop sure knows his stuff. Uh, Impale is four times damage. It, it is not an insta kill, but it can be. <laughs> oh no. Oh. <laughs> Leonardo. All that work. You ended up here, dead in a ditch, alongside Kisa. Oh no, anyway. Yeah, we do have to be careful here. 
I think I will tell green units to attack now. I need to get sold down on this ledge right here. I hope we can get all the way down here. There he Leonard goes, yes. Alright, so time for you to get some experience here with the silver knife. Uh, there is a unit that can attack Micaiah though, that is a little scary. Let's go. Get him, Le get him, Leonardo or Edward. Wow. Sure, glad I kept these two around. the brave sword yeah I probably should have tried and keep keep it but it's fine oh my goodness let's go she might turn out better than risk maybe I'm not actually sure maybe I'm a little bit worried about the Pegasus Knights, honestly, but hopefully they'll die. Yeah, okay, they die. That's good. Come on now, kill them. I hope the yellow units protect Micaiah. I think they'll probably will. Uh, I hope so. <laughs> It's okay, they'll kill the soldier, surely. Look, they kill the soldier. And then the archer will kill the Pegasus Knight, so we're good. They're all running away. Good job, Micaiah. There's like one unit that could attack her, but I don't think it's gonna be a problem. Aaron is now getting two experience per kill. That Paragon sure is uh, doing wonders for him, eh? Can that Pegasus kill Micaiah? No, I gave her a speed wing, so she should be fine. She really should be fine. He goes for the archer instead, pretty predictable. Most of the enemy units are tier 1 and some are tier 2. Yeah, that's true, that's why you get... That's why you don't get a mu much experience sometimes. Kinda depends on who kills. Five deaths... Yeah, this stream has been pretty bloody, it's been a lot of deaths so far. Alright. Let's get Micaiah some experience. <laughs> Let's go. That's right. I'm fighting with Micaiah and Soph. Look at the experience she's getting. Is there a skip battle button? No. Look at that. 19 speed Micaiah. Let's go. Is Manx going to make it? Eh, we'll be fine. Manx is gonna regret this so much. Nah, I'll be fine. I'll be fine.
So let's have a look at uh, Volug's stats now without Wild Wildheart. Let's see how he does. Eh, he's okay. Not amazing, but he's okay. Laura will die. She has shade. They won't go for her until unless they can one shot her. I hope Manx win because I don't want to see Talius ever again in my life. Well, thank you for watching, despite the fact that you hate Talius, Hanako. Hey, my my lore is pretty good actually, so I think she's okay. Oh wow, you are going to die, Green Unit. Why would anyone hate Talius? I mean, I can. I, it, this is my like 87th season of Radiant Dawn. I can see why someone would want a difference. I'm considering Iron Manning something new on Tuesdays. Uh, I was thinking maybe the Last Promise. I've kind of been feeling like I've been wanting to do that for a while. I wonder if it would be fun to do. I just got an ad for the Sandy Hook Massacre. Why, thanks, YouTube. Always nice to see YouTube running wholesome ads on my content. I, I have no control of what YouTube advertises for, guys. Um, I would really like to try Last Promise again. I haven't played it since I Let's Played it. It'd be fun to go back and give it a go. Iron Man Eligor Spare. Manx, you should Iron Man Drums of War best drum hack outside of our Almadon Saga. Really now? Really now? It's quite the statement, Stunlot. Ooh, good job. So, let's go. Nice. I hope... Can I get her to B-rank? Oh, beautiful. Now she can use the Purge in 313. That's actually, that's actually huge. That's actually huge. Have you done a randomizer for Andron Saga? So someone developed a self-randomizer that supposedly worked with ROM hacks. I'm gonna give it a go. The thing is you have to install it and Andron Saga has not a lot of ROM space remaining so I'd have to use an older version, but it'd be fun to see if it works, you know? Oh no. Uh, what if you did an Iron Man for the randomizer? If it works, that would be fun. Maybe the last promise randomizer? I don't know. I feel like that would fuck the game. I, I feel like it's not built around that. Besides, the last promise is an FE7 hack, so it works quite differently from FE8. Tactics Ogre. If I had a penny for every time someone asked me if I could play Tactics Ogre, I'd have... Probably like 103 pennies. I, I, I'm not interested. I'm sorry. Ooh, okay. Edward pissed. He survived. I ain't asking ya. It was a suggestion. Okay. <laughs> Let's go so... Sult is actually getting all right experience. But we are almost at the end now. Oh, there we go. Bye. Hey, <laughs> Edward died. Ah, oh, the scrub grid falls.
Iron Man Soy Emblem. I don't know, the hack is a little too complex for me. Okay, so I could... Yeah, it's gonna end right away, isn't it? I'm pretty sure it's gonna end right away, yeah. Once I kill enough units, it's just gonna end. Alright. Ladies and gentlemen, I think this is a good time to end it. Up next is 313. That's a pretty scary map. Yeah, we're gonna do meme review, don't worry. Yeah, this is a this is a big one. 313. It's gonna be hard. I'm gonna have to fight against my own units here, and they're very scary. All oh, right, this choice doesn't matter. It would have like you get a you get a choice to spare him on your next playthrough, but I'm not doing a new game. Plus, this is it's sad because I actually kind of wanted Peleus, but oh well, it's fine. We have a video? Just, I... <laughs> Hello, Ryoma from Fights. Hello, Nephany. She does look like a blue lobster, doesn't she? According to my base stats, I'm a liar ability. Yes, liar. You're also a liar. <laughs> so long, gay tiger. <laughs> Uh, no, Mononek, no, please. <laughs> we need iron and heroes. And that's it, I think. Yep. Oh, we have a video meme. Let me see, let me bring it up, let me bring it up, let me bring it up, uh, here we go. Okay. Oh, you're showing me the class change glitch. Is that what you're doing? Oh, okay, yeah. Yeah, now you can all see how it works. Yeah, here we go, here. So he does that, and he class changes. <laughs> so here's a generic enemy promotion. That is funny. What a funny glitch. Does he have a name? Oh my god, generic marksman, let's go! <laughs> Look, he has a portrait! That's so funny! Oh, that's funny! So, <laughs> so that's the generic like portrait that it uses, and his name is just Marksman. That's funny. And then, yeah, he becomes a Marksman and he gains Deadeye. That is funny. Yeah, there it is. There it is. He gets the dead eye skill. That is that is really funny. I like that. Thanks for sending it. That was cool to see it. I've never seen it either. I just heard that it exists. Alright. 
Well, ladies and gentlemen, let's just uh, accept the helping hand. Oh, this is the unique... Uh, I've never seen this combo before. I'm going to read it. Hey, Laura, you dropped a staff over here. Oh. Uh, thank you, Aaron. You've been carrying a lot of things lately. Yeah, I suppose so. Many people are injured. I wanted to help and heal as many of them as I can. That's admirable. Is there anything I can do to help? Yes, of course. First, hand me all your things. I'll carry them for you. Oh, what a gentleman. These two are adorable together. That would be great. Here you go, say. Hmm? That stuff you picked up earlier, it doesn't belong to me. Really? It was right at your feet, so I assumed that it was yours. I've never seen a staff like this. I wonder what effect it has. Hey, be careful. It might be dangerous or something. Well, maybe I should. Sh maybe if I shake it like this, and then what? Oh, what did he say, Aaron? Oh, she put him to sleep. <laughs> she puts him to sleep. You're such a clown. How do you fall asleep on your feet? I guess you must be really tired. Why don't I just let you be? Let me take my things back. That's a, I've never seen this combo before. That's adorable. So she gets a sleep staff. <laughs> that's that's strangely adorable. Okay, that's that's cute. All right, let's. T I just want to take a look at the map. I just want to take a look at the map. Yup. Here it is, guys, the legendary 313, where we have to fight against Ike. Oh boy. Oh boy. And how many units do we have to defend? Not many. <laughs> The sleep staff is legit amazing here, though. We can use it to put Ike to sleep, because he only has seven rests. So we can completely neutralize Ike. But what's further, what's very nice is that Mikaya will gain a purge tome, and because I've gotten her to B rank, she can use it, I'm pretty sure. What's the plan for this chapter? Uh, pray. Pick a god and pray. So... There he is. Isn't this 313 Archer? I believe this is 313 Archer. Or is it this guy? I don't remember. Yeah, I think it's this guy. Yeah, it's this guy. He's got higher stats than... Yeah, here he is. Here he is. Here is 313 Archer. The boy. It's definitely the top one. Yeah, it is. Yeah, we're gonna have to pray to True 13 Archer. See if we can get through this. So yeah, we don't have a lot of units. We have Micaiah. We have Soth. We have Toronio. Aaron. Volug. Laura. Seahark. <laughs> and Fiona. Oh boy. We got some bonus experience. We can <laughs> we can train Fiona. Uh, we will see. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that'll be next Friday. Let's do a short Q and A. Fiona will save the run. I think it's a little too late for that now. Maybe you can use the dead weights. Oh, one more chap. No, I'm not doing 313. I'm super tired. I'm gonna die. I'm not doing 313. I will. I will die. So no, thank you. Uh, Dawnlord asks, if I beat Radiant Dawn before you, will we get a Burwick stream? Oh my goodness. You're gonna beat it before me because you play faster than me. But but okay, Dawnlord, sure, a Burwick stream. Sev asks, Manx, do you still have plans to run a FE D and D stream? Yeah, I do. I just have a lot on my plate right now. Um, clip that. Sure, sure. Hanako asks, or Mananek, when are you gonna have another advanced first by web stream? I have them every now and then. I don't have one planned, but they always, I always do one sooner or later. Um, Yut Mit Hut asks, which royal at the end? It really depends on how, like, ideally I'd like to bring people I train to the tower, plus Kurt Naga. 
And then I'll supplement with royals if I have deployment slots left. If I, like, have no units left by the time I get to the tower, of course I'm going to use the royals. I'm not going to troll my run, but... Ideally, I like to use... I like to bring as many units as I've trained as possible to the tower, because I just think it's more fun to use their units you've trained throughout the game, rather than just let Tibarne, Sala, and um, Gifka, and the Lion King, like, just steamroll the tower for you. Ufas, will you keep making scripted videos like you recently have? Also, where are the unit reviews? Um, yes, I will. And what unit reviews are you talking about? Like, anything specific? Conan would ask, tearing Saga Iron Man when? Um... I gotta, I gotta be honest, I'm more curious to try Bervik Saga than Tearing Saga. Um, Michael Mil Milfer? <laughs> Miller. <laughs> Which army do you think will be the most difficult? Oh, I'm gonna have so few units in par part four, but as long as I... I mean, Tibarn kind of carries his army. Um, I do have enough units to make it through part four, I'm pretty sure, so... So, say ask, will you Iron Man Sacred Stones with the Lunatic mode mode? No, no, I am I I cannot play vanilla Sacred Stones. I'm sorry, it is so boring. I I am so bored of vanilla Sacred Stones. Yamatoko asks, enough kidding around, since apparently Oliver is still available for recruitment, just a glorious man into the tower so he can smite Duke Lavain. Oh, I am dumping all my bonus experience on Oliver. We are we are bringing Saint Oliver to the tower, and he is gonna bonk Oshera with the staff. You believe you me? All right, the Andron Saga unit review. I, that kind of just fell through the wayside, didn't it? Yeah. All right. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I am done for tonight. I'll see you guys on Sunday with some more Unicorn Overlord. And uh, Tuesday, I might start Iron Manning a GBA hack. Maybe Elagor Spear. Maybe The Last Promise. I haven't quite decided. I'll see you guys then. Bye-bye.